Whoa! Whoa! Hello! We're finally here, Majora's Mask. It is a rainy, chaotic, apocalyptic day outside. We are more than fashionably late, as per is the usual these days. Uh, hope y'all are doing well. I had to wake Beth up last night at 5.30 in the morning because I was weeping from the Life is Strange 2 finale. So that's where my headspace is at. No spoilers. We have a jolly day though, today. Super jolly because we are doing side quests in Majora's Mask. We're setting ourselves up for success. We're, we're gonna try to set ourselves up to have one more stream of it after this. So we're gonna do a side quest cleanup, getting all our ducks in a row. Gonna be good, gonna be good. Please no Life is Strange spoilers at all. Don't even, don't even whisper a whisper about it. Respect people that haven't had a chance to get to play it yet. That is the last I'm gonna talk about it. We'll talk about it later on. How you doing, Damiani? Damiani! Oh yeah, this is all my Yeah, we fixed the chat situation. Everything's fixed, everything's right. Everything's chat? Fine. <laughs> you see chat? I can't see chat. <laughs> chat, are you there? Please, say something if you're there, chat. Chot? 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 This? What's up? There we go. Oh yeah, I just gotta activate that. You're good. Alright, it's been a minute. Alright. Um, yeah. Welcome to Mike and Mike. As you were said, a little, little fashionably late. We had, a, uh, we had, uh, I had, a uh, big rigs crash and shut down the highway by me. Big rigs. And, uh, even the side road I usually take to bypass that, uh, was jammed. Like turned onto it. Yeah. <laughs> Got past the spot, saw it was already backed up, and I'm like, oh, sh like I was like, maybe it's a light. I'm like, no, there's not a light for miles. Like, this is bad. Turned around, <laughs> went to the other side of town, took another road. It had traffic, but it was at least moving and got on that. So originally I left at like 10 20 a.m. to get here. Yeah. And uh, as I was about to get on the highway, my GPS says it was going to take two hours and 30 minutes. And I was like, Texted Huber. I'm like, Huber, I might be really late today. <laughs> Looks like the highway shut down by me due to weather. Well, everyone's all right, dude. Yeah. Big rig crash. Uh, then I, uh, then once I get, w did the workaround, it took about 20 minutes to get to where I needed to be to start the workaround, and it said it was going to take an hour and 20 minutes. So got here a little after 12, thankfully. Not after 1, like I was freaking out about. Uh, and then unfortunately, yeah, the Raspberry Pi would not, uh, the, brow the Chrome browser wouldn't load chat for us no matter what we tried. Like, we were trying all different sorts of things. We actually rebooted the Raspberry Pi because Chrome crashed on us. Um, Huber found out a... One of Huber's attempts worked on the workaround, so we do have chat up. Um, it's a little bit more narrow than we have, and we can't see... We're not seeing the uh, sub notifications and stuff like that. Uh, we'll see them in chat if we can, but we don't actually see uh, our normal display of them. We had to do a different work run just to like get the chat working. We have to take up the full screen, otherwise, it would be uh, we're not using. We can't use a pop out. We're using part of a window of chat, and that is how it's working. So yeah, I just saw like uh, some uh, some Yana uh, resub twenty months. Thank you. Nice. So we do see those at least, so we'll try and catch those. Excellent. So that is your update for today. Huber, as he says, is going to try and do some side quests. Yeah. Um, Hello. The one thing I'd like him to try and do today it, it is do the... Yes, the Sun and Moon Mess. The Kefi and Andrew side quest. The cafe, sorry. Everybody's, and, uh... friends. Yeah. Um, so we'll see if Huber can, uh, I'll bring out the guides. Um, so I'll basically let Huber wander around and see if he can, uh, figure anything out, or if he's got questions yeah, for just gonna a, what the hell, for a little bit. Um, yeah, talking to NPCs, yeah, consult your bomber's notebook if need be. 
I don't think I did this last time. Or I don't think I realized. You've never, I don't think you've ever been in that room. Yeah. Because the Anju, the the, ca the cafe and Anju side quest is like the best, best side quest, best payoff, and is the most involved thing in this game. Whoa. Like side like quest line. I love when side quests are more intense than the main quest. Yeah. In terms of complexity. So I'll give you one hint. This spot. Optional you obviously you've seen you've seen you've seen this spot with this with this person. Can I like slide into this? No, it's not <laughs> like that. So another thing you can do is the 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 inn in the town, the stockpot inn, involves another character involved with this. The only thing is, what time is it? You might. Uh, I will say this to start part of it. You have to do something really early at the beginning of the first day. Got it. I think you still have time. Yeah, this is a rerun. Also, it, basically, uh... We're watching a repeat right now. A repeat. This is a rerun? Yeah. What's a, what the hell's a rerun? What the hell's a rerun? What the hell's a rerun, chat? Right. Yeah, you got a lot of empty mass spots there, but that's lot, okay. A lot, dude. A lot. It's been a long time since I've done all the mass. I actually don't even remember what all the masks are anymore. Uh, Perkis. Is it Perkis one for gun? on oh, guns? Man, Twenty-one months. Eight a.m. I'm waiting. So wait, wait, wait! Stop. Pause. Pause. So the door's locked. Yeah. What have I told you? You the have roof? to get in there before eight a.m. How would mm. you do it? What, what ideas you got? Sneak in the roof. How you sneak on the roof? You don't have much time. This way. Use this thing. Did you see? Uh, Watchman, yes. Oh, dude, we're not. We can't talk about. No, would, don't even whisper. To. Don't even whisper a whisper, chat. Don't even whisper a whisper well, about almost. it. Almost. Just gotta work on that angle, Huber. Try again. Uh, somebody praising Death Stranding. Death Stranding. Stephen King. New, new person praised Death Stranding. Ooh. Blood Ruth? Blood Ruth? No, famous person. Yes. Famous person? Tell me, uh... It's is a game it, person. Game person. A game person? Like, pause, pause. A just creator? Be, like, pause, because you have, like, ten seconds to do this next thing. <laughs> um, Miyamoto. Sort of. Not him, though. Sakurai. Yes! Praise Sakurai. Death Stranding? Sick. Praise Death Stranding and Kojima. Very cool. Was like, yo, good stuff. Uh, so, I'm just going to tell you, save time, because otherwise you have to research. Go down the stairs and talk to the uh, receptionist, or the... This person? No, no, go down further and take a and take a right and talk to Andrew, right? Right there? Uh oh, you might have been too late. We'll see. Say yes. I just want you to see this. So change it into a Goron. Change it to a Goron real quick. So I want you to see this. Did I miss it? It's eight. No, no, go to, go to go on. The something's about to happen, but if you do this first, you're good. Uh, I just want you to see this part. Now I'll try it. Say yes. Oh wait, no, you. I forgot about this. Uh, try going upstairs real quick and exiting and leaving. I don't know if it, we botched it. Go out the door and then come back in. Here. Yeah. Oh no. Alright, I might have botched this. Botch yeah. Right, yeah dude. It's alright. Okay, so that's where you get to start. But go back down there and watch this. Like, go back and watch what happens down the stairs. Keep watching the door. Front door. Yeah. 
Maybe I want to talk to that guy too. What's up, bud? Yeah. So essentially, if you talk to her as a Goron, you get a reservation. Aww. Yeah. I messed up. Yo. Uh, yeah, I messed you up. I'm sorry. But it's good because, like, I, 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 uh, I actually forget how you figured this out on your own. <laughs> it's all good. Yo. Some new Final Fantasy VII Remake info dropping right now. Yeah? Let's get this. This is freaking me out. Um, actually, after we look at this info, I'm just going to bring up a guide, actually, for uh, the mask. We'll get you going. Dude, stop loading the shitty browser of... I want... Chat says we could uh, reset because we haven't done anything. Should we reload? Oh yeah, you can, you can reload the, the clock, yeah. But basically a Goron comes in and checks in and that's how I guess you figure it out. But yeah. I was trying to remember if there's any other thing that clues you in. Got it. Is uh, it a side quest or no? This is part of the side, the side quest. It the is big part one. of it? Yeah. Uh, yeah, let's reload. This is a very involved one, Huber. All right, so go to, like, before you reset time, leave. Mm -hmm. Chat's saying go to the mayor first. Yeah. So turn back into a human. Mayor Strickland. Mr. Strickland. Hey, then, Strickland! Yeah. Dish, dish, dish. So intense. Try going into that door. I forget if it's open yet. Like, or not. blast out him with a shotgun. All 10 right. a.m. Uh, do undo the inverse song of time. Yo, Reeser, why don't you have the FF7 stuff up yet? Come on. Too slow. Oh, let's copy, uh, Blood's, uh... How you doing, chat? Good morning. Good afternoon. What's up? Hey, uh... So I saw that I didn't see yet. The, uh... Embargo for, uh... Star Ocean First Departure R. When, uh, it was this morning. Um, I have the script pretty much done for it. It's just got to go into production, so... Shenmue 3 is in and, production, yeah. chat. Got some got some reviews coming. Got Imminent. I was working on it. I, uh, I, I played... I did a full playthrough of it. Like, I, I beat it. Um, and then I had to play through a bit again because I needed to, uh... I needed to actually see how recruiting different players changed how things played out uh, in it. Because I actually hadn't done that before. So I wanted to speak to that. And then I played a bit on the Switch to get some... I, I reviewed it on PlayStation 4 on my Pro. And then I played about... Uh, equivalent of, like, maybe the first two hours. But, like, I was rushing... Like, mashing that text button. Like, text skip. Yeah. Uh, to get kind of far. Just to see some stuff. Okay, there you go. Check this out. Um, some, some small performance issues on the Switch. Overall, kind of chugs here and there. Loading into battles on the Switch version, kind of <laughs> chugs, but that was all I noticed. Everything else seemed fine. I tried all three languages. Uh, I will give an uh, interest. This is, will not be mentioned in review, so the uh, haters you don't have to like get angry about this. But uh, just because it's a hot topic again, because he got replaced as Broly, uh, a certain voice actor, you know, who has been like being removed from stuff, uh, and you know, shall, should, you know did very bad things um you know try to, trying to to draw too much heat on us uh they voice a very they voice a se uh playable character but not a main character in star ocean first departure r uh they were in the 2007 2008 english dub of the psp version i have so no idea what you're talking about man. okay yeah. i have no clue yeah uh, I'm out of the Dragon Ball world, man. I don't. I don't. I haven't seen any okay. of the new Brawly movies <laughs> or any seen, of this. What? You haven't yeah. even seen the movie? I've seen the original. What? I haven't seen any super. What? I saw the two. What? I saw Battle of the Gods and Resurrection F. That's it. Come on. Yeah. What? Yeah. All right. I'm so disappointed. This is an awesome scene. I love this. There's like a debate here about what to do, whether they should continue to hold the festival or evacuate the town. It's like a debate going on here, Hubert. It's intense. Anyway, point I'm trying to make here is there is a jet. There's the uh, 2000. There's the PlayStation Portable English and Japanese dubs available. 
Uh, those are still in there. And then there is a brand new Japanese dub based on the original Super Famicom version's VO, apparently. They got like the some of the voice actors back from the OG one and redid their line. So there's three dubs available in it. Yeah. Two Japanese dubs uh, and an English dub. Dubs, Huber. Dubs. Dub, 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 dub. dub. Gotta have subs, dude. Man, I'm like 25 back on Boruto now. Falling off. It's the only anime the I The captain watch. of the guard's name? Viskin. Viskin. I remember that. Hmm. So indecisive, man. Look at that. Viskin, yes! Viskin. We, councilmen, will stick to tradition. The carnival will be a success. Look at this. This is intense. Look at those mouths. Look at those mouths, dude. It's like, that's scary. It what is, is scary. that? It's like Stranger Things, dude. What is that? Demi Gorgon. Oh, what is this? <laughs> Stop. They're evil. Oh, you were gonna scare them. Boom. That is the one thing. Boom. If they ever do a full-blown remake of this game, you know, they did the 3D version, but they do a full-blown remake, I want, like, when you do this, it scares the, the reaction of people. They just freak out. Yeah, dude. Okay, so you got the mayor's record on your book? Did uh, you get yeah, a bomb? Yeah, yeah. Okay, all right, out of here. Uh, he was just having fun now. Unhinged. Huber is unhinged. <laughs> Slow down time. We got Huber. <laughs> Unhinged Huber just destroying. <laughs> destroying the world. Alright, let me get the Majora's Mask guide up. Um, yeah, the, the, anyway, they play a minor character. I'm just kind of surprised that they redid the... They added a whole new Japanese dub. And the... You can actually go into an option when you beat the game and see every line of dialogue, every character. Like, you can replay their lines of dialogue, Huber. Yeah. There isn't that much dialogue for this character, so it would have been very easy to replace it. Dragon Ball Kakarot looks cool. Yo. Chat, if Huber and I will at least play some part of that together. Dude, full playthrough. Yo, if it's like... <laughs> One sit, dude, my, I'll go, I'll Huber, go 12 hours in my head Dragon because I get to play it at E3. In my head. Is basically in taking. My head. <laughs> in my head. <laughs> no. I'll go twelve hours. It is basically Ultimate in Storm One with the Hidden Leaf Village part that they cut out and never went back to. Perfect. But it's got stuff like that with quests and everything, but also like the cinematic stuff of like the best of Ultimate Ninja Storm. So they're taking the best parts of it and throwing it into one. Did that's you play the Ubisoft I'm... ones? Yeah, that's what I'm talking Broken about. Broken bonds and stuff. Wasn't the first one, or is that, that the one I'm thinking of? That might be the one. I, yeah, that Rise might, of the Ninja? Yeah, it might be that one, actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, yeah. Toto! I just, just like, we're going to sit here, we're going to load up. Uh, Chala, hey, Chala. Dude, I know what to do. I know what to do. You know what to do? I know what to do. Whoa, Huber's got it. Do you diddle diddle do? I know what to do. You, you like the name the name Toto? This dude is gonna freak him out. Resident Evil Spirit event I saw I was going on. Uh, uh, it has Wesker, Jill, Leon, and Chris, and they were amazing. What? I heard Jill, though, was like the lowest tier. In what? Uh, Smash Brothers. There's a uh, Spirit event. Yeah, 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 yeah. Jill, lowest tier? Yeah, I put Jill's lowest tier, I heard. I'm out. I saw someone complaining no. about that? Yeah, I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. I'm just kidding. <laughs> what is that, dude? That's disrespect. Alright, what if I play the new wave boss in Nova here? 
Alright, here we go. I don't know. This is wrong. You're getting some it? guides going here. Okay, ready? So you already got the Great Fairy Mask. You don't have Kafee's Mask. Oh, did you go back to the mayor's Kate, place? Here, oh, this is Madame Maroma. Yeah, yeah. Here we go. We yeah, got. Yeah, 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 here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Disappeared about a month ago. Okay. Perfect. You're gonna get. Yes. Here we go, Hubert. Nice. That, got another mask. That's spooky. Got one. Now, now you can like wear it and talk to people in Cheers. town, and be like, "Have you seen me?" <laughs> Have you seen this person? Cafe. Uh, Resident Evil 3 Remake, you know, you know my feelings. Thousand out of ten hype. Couldn't be any more hyped. Just like, the, uh, the trailer. Just baby. imagining how much more intense Nemesis is over Mr. X, and also imagining how much more intense Jill Valentine is over Leonis Kennedy. Let's go. It's gonna be awesome. Do you think they Dude, will... Dude, I'm ready for, like, the dodge... Ma like, what are they gonna do with the dodges and, like... Will they even do... Dude, if Nemesis grabs you and you just, like, stab him in the I face... I mean, are you expecting it to be more advanced oh, yeah. than two? 100%. 100%. Because three has dodging and, like, crafting and... Um, choices. Branching choices, dude. They have to bring that back. Dude, if there's no branching choices, I'll be pretty bummed. Okay. Like, Resident Evil, the remake 2 not having, like, the different scenarios really was kind of a letdown, but I'm, like, fine with it. But if Resident Evil 3 doesn't have branching paths, like, choices, that'll be a bummer. Because uh, I was going to ask you, yeah, I don't, uh, actually, we didn't finish it. I, I don't know enough. Yeah. I haven't played enough times to speak to that other than what you told me. And I remember, like, the, the hints of those. But yeah. I was going to ask you a, there's like a more, the like, pie-in-the-sky fun question. Yeah. Do we see any characters in it that were not seen originally in Resident Evil 3 that can conceivably be there in the remake? Even though they're not playable. Just, like, in the trailer, they make an appearance. Like, do you think there's any part... It'd be really cool if they threw in Ada. Like... After two, you know, when she all that stuff, like you could, you could fit her in in a in a legit way. Okay. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah, really. Legit. Chat just got me hyped on something, Huber. Dude, this environment's awesome. Huber, because I usually just go with me. This. Thank yeah. you for giving this this idea, Chat. End of the trailer. You're Jill. You're chilling in the save room. They're playing the new version of the save music. Yeah. And they're revealing the date. Yeah. Nemesis crashes through the wall. Which means he can attack you in save rooms. Save rooms aren't safe and can be destroyed. That'd be pretty good. <laughs> That'd be pretty good. <laughs> like he just smashes, he just the, smashes the typewriter. It. Yeah, and it's like, what are you gonna do now? Dude, if, oh. he, if he came in and, and just crushed the typewriter, that would be the coolest oh. Resident Evil moment, dude. The intensity of yeah. that. That'd be really like, cool. they, they say, like, they reveal that's, like, the hardest difficulty mode. Like, you can't save. No saves. <laughs> <laughs> Milk oh. bar tonight. Gotta go to the milk bar at night, Donnie. There you go. You figured that out. Uh, Huber, also mm. at nighttime... Wait, is it midnight or is it noon? Oh, it's noon. noon yeah. Okay. Um, the you know the laundry pool, or the pool with the bell, the like little water thing with the bell by it that you've been to, where this kid walks by that area of the town. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, go there at night. I'd like you check it out. Okay. You already got the Camaro mask. Ricky you already Mario? got the blast mask. You did not get the bunny hood yet. Are you remaking PSVR? Um, I thought they were gonna do it with Remake 2, but they ended up not doing it. A VR mode. Uh -huh. Not for the main game. Like a like a little, hey, here's a little tour oh. through. Here's a little tour mode through RPD and VR. Or something weird like that. Just a little spin-off filler. Need, that'd be awesome. They just need to do also uh, basically like uh, on-rails tofu mode where... 
you, uh, like, it, it's just, like, jump scares and stuff, like Haunted House style. Yeah. Like, it'd be a nice little, like, VR touch they added where, you, yeah, you just, like, keep, like, camera always turn, like, you turn, but, like, something, like, yeah, you don't have to worry about, like, controlling and stuff, so, like, you don't have to, like, throw up trying to, like, shoot and play and stuff. Yes, you were going for some rupees here. That's cash, dude. Sell it for cash. Uh, you see, all last three got announced today, pretty much. Did it? Yeah. Co-op this time around, dude. Up to four players. Oh, interesting. That, uh... Interesting move. You say interesting. I mean, I'm always down for... That means, little... like, to me, that vibe you just said was basically, I'm gonna wait and check it out. I want to see what more about what it is. But, like, yeah, I mean, not well, your first preference. It's not my first preference, but yeah. I'm super down. Super down. Especially after, like, two games and some DLCs that are, were all single player, you know? Mix it up. I think you, didn't you already do this? That was the challenge yeah, house. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I don't know if you've done, if you've done any of those other mini games. I think it's late enough in the day you can try these mini games. That's the milk bar. Magic come there at night. Yeah, go, uh, the other, other side. Of the wall. Left. This left. one? No, no, no. Left. Yeah, that. Are you going that building yet? No, right. That door? Oh, it's the Honey and Darling shop. Talk to them? I forget this. The shooting gallery, right? <laughs> Oh, bong cheers, dude. Yo, play Huber. Probably got that hundred rupees. Love this. Yeah. Wait, what the hell am I doing? So you gotta hit targets with the bomb shoes. So just start shooting them off. Like just pick a direction and keep spamming. The spam. Would be my. I mean, try what you want. Yeah. But like, this is how I always did. But. Do you get it now? You have to yeah. hit these targets. There, and don't fall off. Nice, you got one, Huber. Nice. Do you like them? Sh it speeds up, sure. too, yeah. Do you like how it does show a timer? I guess because it's a generic song from the game. I mean, it's the mini game. Ah. Uh, Dang, dude, this one's hard. Yeah. Uh, oh, fell off. crap! Let's try again. This one's fun. <laughs> so I started my, uh... With Beth, Star Wars rewatch. Yeah. We're watching, just like as we eat and stuff, just like Star Wars. Finished Attack of the Clones, Damiani. Oof. It's a rough one, dude. Oof. It's a rough. Uh, yep. I fast forwarded through all the Anakin Padme love scenes dude, when I rewatched it like a few it's, weeks ago. Yeah, I couldn't rough. stand it. I was like, just don't need those scenes. They just are terrible. Absolutely terrible dialogue. We were trying My to boy? think of, and no disrespect to like Hayden Christian, but we were trying to think of like who could have pulled it yeah. off better. I mean, the dialogue was really bad. Thinking, uh, we came to the conclusion, dude, Chad Michael Murray. Oh. Yep. Or, dude, Heath Ledger as Anakin. I think he could have pulled it off. Him and, uh, yeah, even McGregor ripping off each other? Yep. Yeah. You hyped for episode 9? It's coming up, dude. Right, big, I'm ready big to moment. watch it, yeah. Uh, I'm kind of in it for the laughs a little bit. Just, like, see how, like, bad it might go. So I'll give you a piece of advice if you don't win here, Huber. So when you try this, if you're going to try this again, yeah. my advice would be to, for the first ones, when it's slow, yeah. get the ones that are the tallest. Tallest? Because, and then save smart. the, the smart, low smart, ones smart, for the fast. Smart, yeah. smart, 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 smart.
Chat. Sorry. Oh, so close. <laughs> Gigamax Snorlax, yeah, it looks cool. Yo, speaking of Pokemon, Love I uh, just beat Pokemon Always Sword did. last night. How was it? Uh, I was like, that's it? <laughs> um, I didn't. The second didn't half, like, the second half of that game is very rushed. Yeah, uh, the wild area felt... I understand it provides an easy area to grind and catch stuff all in one place. But beyond that, its appeal, after the, like spending two hours in it at the beginning, it didn't really change much beyond what I uh, first experienced. So it was a little disappointing in, in the end, the, the wild area. There's some potential there, but I think they just didn't really do enough with the wild area. Love the towns. Oh man, I love the towns. Like uh, Opal's town. Um, really liked. Uh, uh, I like the gym leaders. I like the music. Um, Inteleon was awesome. Uh, Snipe shot, best move in the game. The most max BM. Cannot understate how cool it looked. One more, Huber. Those don't. Oh no. So close! We're gonna get it. We're You're gonna, gonna get, get it. it. We're gonna get it. It's not as bad as the the jump in that one temple. We're gonna get it. <laughs> Everything I've heard about Pokemon is that it's empty calories. Empty calories. Empty wow. calories, dude. Uh, Nothing wrong with that, though. Comfort food. It makes the world go around, dude. I, I, I think I'm also getting to a point where, like, I, it, yes. Just saying something does the same thing over and over again isn't the, like, it's a criticism, but, like, you need to go deeper than that and, yeah. like, explain why that's bad. Yeah. And I still want to use the shorthand answer of, like, I find after the first few hours of Pokemon, the, 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 the basic gameplay formula of it is just become boring to me. Yeah. Um, some of the gym, like, challenge stuff at the beginning, the mini game stuff was kind of cool, like, okay, I, 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 interesting, but it also, like, they still managed to make it feel shallow as well, it's like, this doesn't feel very, this feels like you had a cool concept, but you executed it in a very lazy way. Yo, the Huber hype! What? Take one more! No! <laughs> oh, I thought it was it! Oh! How about I get my lucky hit? Good grief! I know you got mysterious monsters, Huber, but if you had like a a game like like a game shop like this like what type of game would you want <laughs> something where you're like like some kind of explosive miniature golf okay explosive yeah. miniature golf yeah <laughs> i was wondering if you still get involved axes you know yeah. <laughs> will you play through life is strange 2 now that it's over down the you guys saw the, uh, the notes about, hey, final episode's out. It's like, all right, it's time. time. It's Here. getting close to time. It's time. This is yeah. brutal. I know. That's why eventually I, 
Oh! This is brutal. I is this really hard? Am I just really bad, or is this hard? No, it just you just either get used to it, or literally when it starts going fast, like I, as I say, like I just start spamming. But I mean, I feel like the strategy I gave you is probably a little bit better. I saw a switch sold up, sold a bunch. Uh, next episode of Friend Code, actually, I gotta figure out who's gonna be on it. We're gonna do a uh, 2019 recap episode, um, just because. So here's the here's the thing. The Game Awards happens in the week. It happens after Friend Code, and too late in the week to hold off on Friend Code. There's there's too much stuff going on. Plus, the podcast is gonna cover Friend Code or uh, Friend Code. Yeah, okay. Obviously, the podcast will like cover like the Game Awards too. So like, it's a, like we're gonna do enough. Game Awards coverage that, like, I don't think we need to, like, triple or quadruple dip with Friend Code. So, Friend Code is going to do a, uh, the week of the Game Awards, we'll be doing a look back at 2019, and then the week, the episode after will be the last episode of the year, we will do a looking forward to 2020, which will include any of the Nintendo announcements. You know, like, obviously, probably, like, the fifth fighter from Smash. Yes! Super! All oh, done! Yes! But there won't actually be an episode dedicated just to the Game Awards announcements. Like, hey, there might be no Nintendo... Watch! Maybe there's no Nintendo announcements at the Game Awards. <laughs> you know, never know. Maybe they do a Stealth Direct like the week after. They announce everything there. You know, never know. Maybe Doug Bowser is just, you know, not the same as Reggie. Wait, that was it? Mm -hmm. Wait, you didn't get anything? Talk to them again? <laughs> Did I lose? I lost. Wait, it was a loss? It was a loss by a, by a millisecond. Wait, what? <sighs> I hurts. thought you did it. That hurts, man. What? Chat, run the clip back. Chat, run it back. There's another one. Oh, I thought it ended. So the time ended it, so it wasn't... Okay. Yeah, it's so like when I get cl like how I do it is like when it gets close I start spamming. Oh, you got hit by the damage? You might want to like realign yourself. Yeah, like the angled ones like that are harder to hit. Dude, they like. They, go. they got a mind of their own. They are bomb shoes. <sighs> Gonna get ya. Oh. Uh, this is a getcha. mini. This is a mini game. Yeah, I'm not leaving. The only, the only place I'm going is in the bank to get more groupies. <laughs> we end the stream. We cleaned out the bank. Whoops. Oh, you hit them. And you got special dialogue. I didn't even know that it was possible either. Awesome. Why am I so bad at this? With this... Would you, would you be disappointed to see this as a mini game in Shenmue 4? No. I'd be intimidated, though. Yeah, if you got a better strat for him, chat, let us know. He raises unleashing. Fire everything! Rain fire! Come on, man. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, perfect. Good grief. Look at that. <laughs> Did you see that? He got a perfect score. First try.
time to leave. Let me get out of here. Bye bye. <laughs> is, is that a troll? Is uh, that's you got you got me. <laughs> you got me. I forgot what it gave you. Uh, go to it's nighttime. Go to the pool area. Pool. Remember with the bell. Yeah. Where is it? Uh, left. Down. Yeah, you want to go all the way to the front. Remember the main area, right? Yeah. He needs this to get the bunny head. So now chill here. Is there no one here? Oh, uh, leave. Oh, wait, actually, wait a sec. Wait. No, no, no. Wait for time. I guess you have slow times. So just gotta wait for it to turn six o'clock. Yeah, it's not night time yet. It's almost night time. Ugh. Frog, yeah. Here we go. Nice. Behind you. Yeah, here we go. Huber. Yeah. Check out this mess. Listen to his confession of guilt. Dude. It's one of my favorite masks. Uh, do you know something that changed on the buttons? It's giving me like pet cemetery vibes. Oh boy. So uh, you have two options you can do with this. Uh, not with this quest, but that mask. Um, there's, there's a place, so it, uh, he said he was a troop leader and it, he led animals. So where's a place with a lot of animals? The forest. The forest? Yeah. The forest. The forest. There's a lot of animals. No, in this game. <laughs> In Majora's Mask. Um, have you been to a place that uh, would normally have like be known for having animals? The farm. Yeah, how do you get the to farm, the farm? The farm, the farm, the Song of Soaring. Yeah, but is there something else? Yeah, that's the warp to the statue near it. But what else do you need to get access it? A horse. I mean, you could warp there, and it might jog your memory. Like, yeah, try warping there and see okay. if it jogs your memory. Yeah, I totally forget. Totally forget. Totally forget. Uh, down, left, up. Down, left, up for the song. Yeah. 
Wish they had that song. Nope. Milk Road. Milk Road. To the Milk Road! Are you gonna play Phoenix Point? Me? Yeah, it's Chad S. Uh, probably. Probably not. Alright. Let's check it out. Ch -ch 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 check it out. Go ahead. That's backed. That's to the race. This way, this way. This way? No. Yeah? Yeah? Yeah. With the bombs. But I don't have a. Ah, there you go. Remember where to get those? Yeah, from um, the Goron. Or you could buy one. For 50 rupees. Yeah. So back to Clockdown. Got it. Luigi's Mansion, yeah, high on my list. Yeah, I beat Luigi's Mansion. Disco Elysium, like, Outer Worlds, Ace Combat 7, probably Metro gonna, Exodus, yeah. all of my list. All of them. I started, so here's the thing, chat. That's my And key. you're going to hate me, but you know, you know my preferences. Uh, I started, before I started Pokemon Sword and Shield, after I finished Luigi's Mansion 3, I installed and started Outer Worlds Outer on PCs. Worlds. Um, yeah, I have it on PC. And then I played about an hour, and I stopped playing. I kind of don't want to go back, so here's the reason. That's why. a bad feeling, dude. I hate that feeling. So, like, listen, like... Uh... For whatever reason, you can be upset with me. I mean, first person's a hard barrier to overcome, and for whatever reason, this game, like, was getting on my nerves with it. Like, first person stealth, like, uh, what was that stu- that game, not stupid, I'm sorry. It's stupid to me, but everyone loved it. Uh, stealth game, assassin, uh, steampunk, whales were, like, like a big- Dishonored. Thing. Dishonored. One of the greatest games uh, ever made. I, I the... can't stand that game. I Dude, can't you stand and it. Kyle. I can't stand Gosh. it because of first person stealth. I, 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 ab I abhor first person stealth like i need third person i cannot do first person stealth fair it's just enough. not for me fair enough so it's just a personal thing it's not like a, a indictment against the game that was part of it huber i really get disinterested and turned off by having all these choices in terms of like your stats allow you to pick pick an option, just play like, how you intimidate, play. lie, and stuff like that. Yeah, play how you want to play, dude. It starts making me go, like, oh, what do I... I it, There's no wrong answer, man. I, play how you want to play. That's the beauty of it. Uh, like, Deus Ex. I just Deus stop. Ex like, is uh, literally the only game, Domiani, that actively convinces me to, like, not do side quests because of the role play. You know what I mean? Like, oh, it doesn't make sense for my character that, that, to be doing think, that right I think, I think now. You just answered I'm it. Gonna, Huber, like, I think you just answered it, dude. Yeah, I love that. I don't like doing RP in games. Uh, like, okay. I don't want. I, I don't like RP. crafting my story. I, I like RP. having someone who's crafted a story for me. I like it. I like it all. Yeah. I like it all. Or I just play it like, or otherwise, it's just like I'm playing like a game for gameplay, and I don't care about the story. One or the other. Got it. Yeah. So I'm not a. Uh, Grabbing a drink. All right. Yeah, I didn't try it yet. Just a yeah, it's a it's the thing I just don't gravitate towards, unfortunately. So I don't know if I'm gonna go back to Outer Worlds. I think I'll just like abstain from. Uh, when that game comes up for discussion, I'll just be like, ah, it wasn't for me. It's not gonna. I didn't make choices in Skyrim though. I I just like destroyed everything and i didn't play through all of skyrim i played it for like a, a few hours if you made me have to play through all of skyrim i probably would have quit too yeah no no you don't use you, the first person man doesn't it like make you sick yeah like skyrim was it's like no fault of the game it's like you you get sick playing it you know it's like nobody's fault it's like genetics for outer like wilds I, 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 for outer wilds the other game uh i, I want like a like a math expert, like a rocket scientist next to me, or a person who can do the calculations. Min maxing for uh, the guy launches. Probably already and, exists. Like whoever's a Kerbal Space Program genius yeah. to sit with me. So I'd be like, I Outer want worlds? 
for Outer Wilds. Wilds, the different game. Got about it. exploring space. Got and, it. uh, well, it's like. You go on a ship and you end up in like you travel to other planets. It's yeah, like, really quick. It's, is Outer Worlds and Outer Wilds the Dante's Peak and Volcano of video games? <laughs> I mean, no. Is that they're they're like they while they're both sci like have that sci fi and space theme, they're not trying to do the same thing. <laughs> not okay. not even remotely. Okay. One, I would say like Outer Wilds <sighs> is like shooting more for like. Uh, it, uh, not it's not the exact same, but shooting towards the trajectory of like no man's sky direction of like, yeah. oh, what are you gonna find? Discovery, like what is out there? Whereas Outer Worlds feels a little bit more narrative driven from my scene. Like there's definitely a crap like a world crafted for you to go through, meet characters, you know, you know, and a purpose. Where yeah. Outer Wilds is like, what do you want to do? Yeah, totally. Find out, like, here, here's some fun. <sighs> that stuff, I'm not as into. Puzzles, good point. Yeah, there's puzzles. That's the level of RP that I can't even get into. Okay. Like, you are a blank harvester space traveler. Go explore. Like, <laughs> I, I always burn out of those games, Damiani. Yeah. Right. Closer to the witness. Okay. Sorry. Okay, Thank so you. I got the bomb. Got the Thank bomb. you for the correction. Wait, do I need to go to the milk bar, dude? I don't want to miss that. Oh, yeah, try going to the milk bar. You can see that. Yeah, the witness. Me too, the, DJ. Did you buy the bomb? I did. Okay, you bought the counter. Okay, cool. I, yeah. I think so. No, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, cool. You know, like, it's nighttime, so you don't have to yeah. worry. So do some nighttime stuff here. Yeah, yeah I'm going sure. to the milk bar. Dude. Sure. It's over here. I generally Oops. feel so, like... Object-based puzzles, where you have to move stuff. So here's the puzzles I like. I like physics or object-based puzzles. I like pushing boxes because yeah. of Resident Evil. But you know the first puzzle in Uncharted 4, in the jail cell or whatever. Or the cell or whatever, where you look on the walls. Mm -hmm. And you gotta, like, I brute force that because I hate puzzles like that. Yeah. Pretty tough. So, yeah. So when I hear about... Uh, the witness. I don't know much about like what types of puzzles it has. So I'm always when people say it's like some of the hardest puzzles ever in a video game. Oh, it's not eight o'clock yet. I'm super worried that it's like you got to read a bunch of stuff and like fig like logic puzzles like by reading like you know the the old puzzles were like so and so could not have done this and like I hated those. I was like no. Yeah. I was like I hate like. I need to see stuff. I can't like read stuff and then like visualize a lot of time. I have to be shown stuff. Yo, Chad, is this Stardust? Stardust. Is this Stardust, Chad? It's the club in Yakuza. <laughs> Iconic location. Stardust type. Did not play the return of Overdin. Overdin. I'm waiting till 8 So it's all visual puzzles. Okay. Then I might like it. So RE3 Remake is confirmed one of the two secret playable Capcom games at Jump Fiesta. What's the other one going to be? I mean, I've, I've seen people say it's definitely not a fighting game. Like A lot of people said like they'd be absolutely shocked if it was a fighting game. So, I mean, is this like it's going to be playable there? Oh, my oh, God. They said, secret, they said secret playable. If it's Dragon's Dog. Why would, why would they? Uh, like make, I think Mega Man X9. Because I think that's getting announced at the, not the Game Awards, I think that's getting announced yeah. at the Mega Man event. And that's, no offense, but that is smaller, yeah. it's a smaller it's project. It's gonna be X9. Yeah, it's a smaller size project. It's gonna be X9. You're right. Just, the, like, let's say that. I bet, I uh, yeah, that. Resident Evil 3 Remake, X9 are getting announced probably sometime this month, at the latest. And then I would say next E3 will be, uh, potentially Resident Evil 8, right? We got to, like, hear about Resident Evil 8 at some yeah. point, right? Yeah, we Like, do. E3. Next gen. Dude, it's like, a 7 replay. Wait, dude. But if Resident Evil 3 is 2020, I get the vibe it has to be this gen. And it'll be cross-gen. Resident Evil 8? 3. Remake. Oh, 3 cross-gen? They're, they're yeah. announcing it so soon. Yeah. Because it won't... I don't think it's going to be next... Like, a launch... Like, a title that comes out post-next gen. Um, I think you'll also maybe get a... You might get... It might be too soon. So the possible things you can get at E3 from Capcom would be Resident Evil 8 announcement. 
Uh, I wanted to, uh, I feel it in my bones. Fighting game. A new fighting game announced from them. From? S from Capcom. Nice. Uh, Capcom, I think it's for next gen, it's time to announce what the first fighting game will be from Do them. Do you think Power Stone will ever return? Uh, nah. Unfortunately, probably not. I think you're right. A Resident Evil fighting game. I really want to play Project Resistance, dude. I just want to play it. Oh yeah, Project Resistance. I just really want to play it. I just really want to punch someone as Mr. X, dude. That's all I want. <laughs> like, if there's just a moment where I can just play as that, yeah, let's do this. Like, let me just do... Dude! You just, like, knock Whoa. someone out, dude. I'm all about it. Choke slam. <laughs> Excuse simple me. man, it's a simple, it's a simple ask. Yeah, it was a joker. <laughs> I'm a simple man. <laughs> I like the man of my word. Gas was a gasoline and bullets. Yeah, <laughs> they're cheap. They're cheap. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're not going in. <laughs> so good. Can you imagine him as Anakin, dude? Yeah. Let's see how loyal a hungry dog really is. I think my problem with Attack of the Clones was they went a little too hard. <laughs> they went a little too hard on like Anakin being like yes. Darth Vader. Oh. He's gonna be Vader. Like if if he was just a straight up good guy in that movie, and the one part so, where he's dark dude. is Tusken Raiders. Dude, just the one part. Dude, have you watched Clone Wars? The I show? Haven't, yeah, I haven't finished it. I started it. It's too much. But it's like it's a lot. But like I would say, just maybe just watch a few episodes yeah. in the chronological order sure. to understand the bonds they're building between Obi Wan and Anakin. For and Anakin's sure. relate like bonds with like Jedi. Like he has a Padawan and stuff. So it's like sick. It, it makes me feel more the, the tragic fall of true him. emotion. It would have like that moment would have made. So, been so more impactful in episode yeah. three having any of that stuff just revealed on screen in any of the films or if it was just a better actor that's, that's straight it. up straight up <laughs> like i hate you yeah. uh yeah so remember uh, animals and you have that mask so um wh wh what do you think what are you thinking i don't know um, right, you already got the horse. Uh, do you remember any parts of this map? I mean, there's a house here. Mm -hmm. Are there any other areas of this map? She's so definitely gone somewhere before here. It's funny how you can't actually ride it. What? You can play this song, but like, oh wait, never mind. I'm wrong. I'm sorry. I was, yeah, that was wrong. Uh, yeah, but do you remember any other parts of this area? I'm searching over here. What is all this? Oh, baby. What's that? Looks promising. Come on, man. <laughs> I mean, all you have to do is play the song a double time. And you're there. Right, right. Right, right. A, A, down, down. I don't know. I'm not like I'm not like a like a Star Wars like mega fan or anything like that. I've enjoyed some of the Star Wars stuff. I really like. And I can and there are part points where I was like, oh yeah, let me get into like the official lore. I, but like, never got into any expanded universe <laughs> yeah. stuff. Like it was yeah. never like. I just, like I just enjoyed what was put in front of me a lot me of the too, times. But the prequels, uh, I mean, I bought into the hype with them, and in like reality set in, I was like, these aren't that good. Um, and, Dude, I love them. And I know you love them, but like my rewatch made them made my dislike of them only grow. Um, there was like, a summer in my life, Damiani, where I watched Phantom Menace every night when okay. I was like ten years old. Uh, uh, the VHS. Nice. Check this out, Huber. Come to me, little chicklets. 
Dude! This is really You were jolly. just figuring this out. It's so good. It's a 10 out of 10 jolly right now. This is like an anime. Like, ent ent like ending. Totally, dude. This is the Gohan. Like, youthful Gohan right now. As a child, dude. Before he's like brutally inserted into a galactic war. So the only thing I'm sad is you didn't see his original thing. Basically, he like said he dreamed about like seeing the like them grow up or whatever. Oh. And then he made his dream come true. Nice. Yeah, I think we. But now to him you a got this. Ago. Yeah, but now you got this. Check. Yeah. They make me go fast, and then I can catch that girl before she goes back inside. Am I right? I feel right. Did he try the mask yet? <laughs> Too bad I didn't animate with your hands. <laughs> oh, one could have missed dream. opportunity right there. So next up, uh, you didn't get this one. Uh, something about the milk for the milk bar, though. He needed the animals. I think we we blew up the boulders, so I assume I just talked to him now. Am I wrong in thinking that? So, uh, what day are you on? You're day two, right? Yeah, a lot of these are the... Ooh, yeah. Okay. Whoops. You got the Mask of Sense. Uh, several of these masks are tied to uh, the Andrew ca uh, Cafe. Sorry. Um, you can also get the, uh... Uh, leave here and go to the racetrack nearby. Nearby? Remember the racetrack? Yeah. Yeah, the bunny mask can go past it. Looking for... What are you looking for? The horse. Ah, nice. Horse is not happy right now. Here. Miss Arthur Morgan, dude. Arthur Morgan. Yeah. I always hear everyone, you and others, talk about Arthur Morgan. I'm just like I'm taking your word for it. Did you play Red Dead too? No. 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 Why not? <laughs> Scared, Why not? scared of the janky controls. Jane, dude, it's, a, it's <laughs> like, aren't you curious? Though? It's like one of the biggest games ever made. Uh, a couple hundred million dollar budget, dude. Rockstar. Just like, ah, uh, nah. I don't need to try it. Go like, on. what? <laughs> I don't need to try it. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Which one? Go this way, right? Okay. Like, no, I'm good. It's like somebody not seeing like Star Wars Episode Nine, dude. Just being like uh, Star Wars Episode <laughs> Star Nine, Wars. like nah. All right, for this, I'm uh, good. All right, speak. Yeah, no. On the horse, talk to uh, 
talk to them. Like, at least just, like, curiosity, you know? Yeah, so walk up to them with your horse. Uh, uh, do you need money for this? I'll we'll find out. Yeah. Easy target, and you can talk to them. See this Huber. You might all uh, they might have to come back for uh, some more reviews. So careful. So pace your carrots. I would recommend only using another one when one's replenished. Be my only piece of advice. Otherwise I'll shut up. He's gonna jump over it, dude. That's all right. How much did it cost? Ten rupees. Ten, yeah. yeah there might be some outside here. You don't have to go all the way back. Yeah. Should I bring the horse? Well, let's stay here. <sighs> Forget it. Until I bring it. Hurts. Uh, I, I can give I can give you any more pointers if you want. Otherwise, I can I'll just keep quiet. No, dude, I had it. Yeah. I'm confident. Confident, Damiani. The only thing I really want—I want to point out one thing because it's made clear, very painfully obvious to anyone who's played Ocarina of Time, because you would have had to have done this to get the horse in Ocarina of Time. Yeah. So I feel like you might not realize it. To get the horse, can I tell you how you get the horse in Ocarina of Time? Yes. The ho uh, to get the horse in Ocarina of Time, after you learn the Pona song and all that, and you go to the guy who has your horse as an adult. Mm -hmm. You gotta you gotta race them and stuff, but before you're allowed to race them, you have to demonstrate you could like ride a pona and, and do it. And what you have to do is you have to jump two gates with a pona. Got it. And then after you win the race, he won't let you leave, and you have to jump a gate to leave. So you're so, saying I can jump the gates? There you go. Got it. That would have been obvious. To, jumping gates would have been obvious to anyone who's played Ocarina of Time. Can it's, I it's shoot them with a bow and arrow? No. Okay. That is not possible. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> like you're thinking, yo, Huber. Just make like, why, why play evil, <laughs> <laughs> evil Huber right here? I mean, this game doesn't explain that you can jump fences in it. Whereas in Ocarina of Time, it's it's mandatory. You will see that a horse can jump a fence. Because this game came out like shortly after as a sequel, they probably expected most everyone to have played Ocarina of Time. It was also like one of the biggest games ever, like everyone had pretty much played it. So you could get away with not explaining that. Obviously, if you accidentally are in a burst and you're near a fence here, Huber, you'll like jump here? it, yeah. Keep up your momentum. Like use one more. There you go. Now yeah, be careful. You can jump those dirt patches if you it, you need to burst over them so you don't get caught. Uh, just jump the fences here. There you go, Huber. Nice. Don't give up. Yeah, like, ah! Don't slow down! Yeah. Look at this. <laughs> get wrecked. Dude! Ninja Spirits! Dude! Yo! Oh, 
This is for Huber. Dude, what is this Ninja mess? Spirit. Go Ninja, go Ninja, go. Dude. So it's fun because uh, this is that's an important mask actually. Didn't see Frozen 2. For some reason, uh, the only like Disney animated movie Beth is just not super into. Frozen. We watched Frozen 1, she's like, yeah, it's good. Okay. Frozen 2 is like, hey, do you want to go see it? She's like, no. Okay. All right, I guess we're not seeing it. All right. Disney I Plus, I guess we're waiting for. All right, <laughs> I haven't seen either. Yeah. Another one, first one's on Disney Plus. Yeah. Um, you went to the milk bar at night. What happened there? I forgot. Uh, he was talking about really expensive milk, 200 rupees, but the delivery was blocked by the big boulder at the ranch. Oh, okay. That's fine. Uh, what time is it in the game? Because you go back at night, there's something you can do. Cool. It's a kind of a cool quest, too. I saw 21 bridges, dude. That one was cool. One, Check it out when it's on demand or something. One bridges. The entire third act is completely unnecessary. Okay. But the movie is cool, dude. Twenty on bridges. Uh, is Knives Out the one with like the like the family at the yeah, house? It's gotta, yeah, it's got a. I need, I to, don't see, yeah, I need to see that. See it in the theater, dude. Theater experience. Uh, I need to see it. Theater experience. Uh, you can just straight up play like the song double time. What is it? To go to night. Right. Uh, right, right to AA, down, down. Nice. So you can do this one. Um, what's today? The 4th or the 5th? Today is the 4th. Dang it. So tomorrow night at midnight will be Marriage Story. Okay. It's like my most hyped movie right now, dude. It's between I feel so uh, bad. Like, my top three is Endgame, Once Upon a Time, in what is, Hollywood, so and The Irishman. What is, what is this movie, Huber? Marriage Story? Yeah, what is this? Noah Baumbach, and it's got Adam Driver and Scarlett Johansson getting a divorce. Whoa. Yeah. Alright, let's see if yeah. we can go to the milk bar. I forget what time I opened. But everyone, at like the, the early praise was that uh, it's just like incredibly active and very Ooh, emotionally, nice. emotionally resonant. Uh, I don't think you need rupees for this. Yeah. Witcher, dude. You don't I watch The to... Witcher? I'll watch. It's on yeah. Netflix. I'll watch the first episode, see yeah. how it goes. Uh, Parasite. I need to see Parasite. Yeah, you do. I need to see that. Parasite also. I will. Five. Yeah, Parasite is... It's got a number, reputation. It's my number say. four of those three I said, though. Uh, Hosanto57, thank you for 34 months. Some good movies this year. Some good movies, some good games. Some good TV. Is there not someone here? What? What the shit? What? Chat, you can't see That's this right now? freaky, dude. The, ch the TV is trying to hit pause. The TV is trying to hack my iPhone right now. Your permission is required for you to connect to the TV. Allow, deny, close. Deny. Deny it, dude. Deny. deny. Who's, deny. Stop trying to hack my iPhone, TV. Deny. Deny. <laughs> Denied. Uh, yeah, I guess, like, chill out in here. I guess chill like, out. If he's not in here, there's supposed to be a character who shows up. Chill out. Chill out. Why didn't anybody see Terminator Dark Fate? I'm sorry, Huber. It's alright. Not a movie, not a Pacific Rim situation where I'm gonna, like, die on a sword for it. Oh, wow. Yeah, Huber really goes, well, you mean Pacific Rim 2? Mm -hmm. Yeah, Huber goes mm -hmm. out, like, hard for on a limb. Like, it was way out on a limb for her to Pacific Rim 2. <laughs> They made one of the, like, well, the, the, one of the times I can most easily, the one thing I can recall the most easily about <laughs> disagreeing with Huber the most on. Pacific Rim 2? Pacific Rim 2 was like, I love like, it! What the hell, yeah, I love it! Like, okay, Huber. I don't no. care. 
<laughs> that's, oh, that's, that's like humor's real prison of love. <laughs> yeah, dude. We're all watching Pacific Rim up We're locked in and we'll rewatch. Rewatch of that. No, first Pacific Rim is amazing. Oh, hell yeah. Classic. Yes, first one's amazing. Guillermo, dude. Next level. It wasn't like it was a terrible movie, too. It's just like, I, yeah, I just don't To be fair, I saw it in the IMAX. <laughs> and Hebrew does IMAX swear don't. that IMAX is the deal, like... It enhances. Yeah. It enhances your, your experience. <laughs> uh, they come in maybe a little later, I guess? <laughs> But I blew it up. On the first or second night. So you're on night two right now. I'm on morning two. So I need to get to no, night. It's, I know it's night. So you the moon's out. Oh. I think you just gotta wait a little bit for the guy Tell to come him. in. Yeah, yeah. Eight o'clock. Eight o'clock. I was about to say. Eight o'clock. Eight o'clock. Look around. Maybe they're walking here already. Eight I think. I think <laughs> What's like, that in? Was that you or is that? No. I was about to say eight o'clock. Some Ghostbusters. Yeah. Bank man. <laughs> that's right. That's right. When he's uh, trying to pick up the girl. By letting her guess all the things, the tarot cards, and she's getting them all wrong, but he's pretending she gets them all right, and he's trying to piss off the other guy to get him out of there. And he actually, the guy actually gets one right, and he still says wrong. <laughs> you volunteered, we're paying you for this. Yeah, but I know you're gonna give me electric shocks. Just what are you trying to prove anyway? I'll tell you what the effect is. It's pissing me off. You watch Ghostbusters again. How do, you, how do you feel about that title for the third, the Ghostbusters three? What's it called? Afterlife. Isn't Ghostbusters three though go, the Ghostbusters so video game? So the third Ghostbusters, the, the third ever made. Oh, you're talking about the game? Yeah, the game. I don't know films. The third made film is Ghostbusters 2016, but in the chronology, Ghostbusters 3 would refer to the one coming up. Got it. 2016 is not in the same timeline. I like that movie, though. Yeah. I, I had problems with the... Mostly the CG stuff in the 2016 film. I didn't like the ghost stuff. It was my biggest problem with it. Everything else was like, yeah, but the ghost stuff was kind of like... Eh, eh, eh. Too much money spent on, like, extravagant ghost nonsense. Like, they need ghosts, but, like, subtlety. Yeah. You know, less is more sometimes. Sorry, so there's a, there's a person you've seen who comes in here and you're going to talk with them. Got it. And I, I think you'll... Re I, I really like this one. Cool, cool, cool. Sorry. I uh, actually can bring up their schedule, I think. Go to the book. Sorry, it's almost 8. I'm I don't kidding. know if they come at 8 or 10. Oh. So bring up the book, the Bomber's Notebook, and we're going to go see what their schedule is. Go to uh, Gorman. That guy up. Yeah, when does he Yeah, when does he show up? What's that time? Oh, you can't see? Uh, it's like 8, because... 18? 6. Oh, uh, no, it's like 8 or 9. Okay, so we're about... Eh. We'll see. Let's yeah, just wait. Uh, you can undo the inverse song of time if you want. Eh. Alright. Just hanging out. Hanging out. Um, uh, yeah. Uh, it's a little for shit. Another Ghostbusters one made with Harold Remus. You know. Egon you know, after the Dragon last night's Force. stream, Damiani, it made me wonder if, like, what direction the Alien and the Predator franchises can go, you know? I mean, that's like how do you the make it? Story would how do you make it great again? How I, do you how do you capture the the vibe of Alien? I mean, you need to stop setting. They need to you stop. You need to break setting, away from Ripley. No, not only that, they need to stop setting shit on modern day Earth. Like, stop that shit. Like, that needs to end. Like, AVP. It's like yeah. th that setting sucks. Let's yeah. not do that anymore. Oh, but Predator was great, and Predator Two. It's like, uh, yeah, for their time, but like. It's played out like doing it in modern day. Let's get and then like well we did Predators. I'm like well Predators wasn't that bad. You know Predators, Predators was okay. A little cliche with the the group of people they throw on the planet, Dude, but that. but you know I mean <laughs> a little cliche, but I mean Samurai. some great moments. Yakuza dude. Keith, yeah. Yakuza dude versus Predator. <laughs> So awesome. In a freaking tall grass field, I was like, okay, okay, <laughs> love it, okay, love it. Um, yeah, like if you're gonna, if, if you're even gonna have humans in AVP, they need to be like colonial marines. Like we need like, and this needs to be a straight up action film. Yeah. 
Yeah, what if you went the Warcraft route and it was like all predators? Predator like tribe, dude. And I think it needs to be like. It'd be amazing if it was like one alien, one. Okay, you getting some ideas here. Not yet though. One alien, one predator, one colonial marine. Cool. They'd be sitting at the bar when they arrive. Okay. We're back. I think someone's walking over here. Look around. What's that noise? Water with two. Is that good? Alright, we're good. We're back to fight the evil. Uh, yeah, it's, this is second night. They should be here. Unless we didn't do something? Crap, is there something else to do? Just got a message. Lost stream. Blower says he's back. Oh, just wait in the bar area till like, ten... You need the... Oh, no. You need the... Don't you have the mask? The milk bar mask. The, the cow head, right? Does this work? I forget. Try it. Shit, what's the members only thing again? Damn it. Forget. Damn. It is. That's who you need to talk to. Shit. I think he kicks you out if you're not out by the after 10 p.m. anyway. Oh, wait, wait till 10, wait till 10, wait till 10, wait got till it, 10. Got it, got it. Alright. Do, 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 do. Do, do, do. But he was able to go in before, so I was like freaking out while I was rejecting him. Kid's just like looking at you, it's like, what the hell is Dude, this? Dude, if I saw somebody do a backflip and then that? Like, like your favorite thing to do? Yeah. Can you do something that, does a Yakuza have any like cool stuff like that? Like a move, like a trademark move that you like, just like, got like, it just feels right. Um, my all-time favorite move in Yakuza is grabbing a thug's head and smashing it into the wall. Oh. It's a Brutal. 10 out of 10. Brutal. It's in like every single Yakuza game, pretty much. Brutal. <laughs> Someone said Tiger Drop. <laughs> also, the classic uppercut is just really nice. Uppercuts are good, Hubert. Yeah, yeah. All right, let's And there's this. also one where if they're on the ground, you just punch their head. <laughs> so brutal. Yeah, so brutal. Can't believe the next one's in... Uh, put on the mask now, maybe? So wild. Cool. Nice. All right, so here we go, Huber. So talk to that NPC now. Oh shit! He's still gotta sit down. <laughs> Look at this! <laughs> Look at real time. They're on a schedule here. Shenmue, dude, it's awesome. Yeah, N64. Yeah, taking a seat. All right, check him out. You know it's supposed to be alcohol. Yeah. Talk to some other people here. Heck yeah. Here you go, Huber. Uh-oh. Alright, follow the directions. Okay. Good. 
Whoa. Sad. Angry jump, drunk. Um, so Huber, there were other spotlights there. Yeah. What are you thinking? I don't know. Hmm. So he said he'd do the same thing. So, uh... It's an accident. Yeah, so... Hey, do you notice those spotlights? Yeah. Anything about them? Different colors. Yeah. Different songs. Um... Don't look at me. What else can you try? Any ideas? Yeah, I'm gonna do, uh... Getting there, getting there. So awesome. Is it this one? Decades? Yeah, that's right. Forgot about it. Cool, cool, cool. How, what's the context here?
<laughs> there you go. Sad. Look at that. Um, yeah, chat. That sounds nothing like the Ballad of the Windfish, though, unfortunately. Dude, we're filling up here. We're doing, uh, yeah. we're doing okay. Um... Uh, Oh, dude! What? It cries? Yeah, look at that, look at that! Look at that. that that's too much. That's too much. Um, it's still nighttime. Uh, go see how many rupees you have in the bank. Might be doing a big spending here. Whoops. Oh! <laughs> uh, getting crafty there. We have a buckle, have we? I don't think no one said anything. Just that one time, it seems like. Hey, we're getting it. Hey, internet in process, being changed. Still happening. It's in the works. Yeah, that's how many rupees you have here. I was having to chat your line in a second. Oh, that's true. Let me check. I might have lost internet. Get the cash, Huber. Oh, no, internet's up. Chat, you there? Yeah, no drop frames. Nah, still the internet's here. Yeah, it's. They're, ch they're chatting here. It might be this. Shit. It is. All right, so chat, you're, uh, we still see you on the main monitor, but the on the Raspberry Pi, it froze. Maybe just refresh this page? Yeah, I'll try to refresh it on this page. Oh! Does F5 not refresh? It's a good mask action today. That was cool. That was a cool side quest. What the hell? Uh-oh. That's the oh, freakiest no. shit I've ever seen. What the fuck is Oh, this? no. Please, don't do this. Ghost chat. Okay, 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 okay. Stop! No, oh, it crashed. You want stars? I'll give you stars. <laughs> Resident Evil 3 Remake. Oh no, now it's the thing that's going back to the homepage. Here. No! Hear my Raspberry Pi! <laughs> 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 Just, uh, you have yeah, to go through manually, so you have to search. Doing search, doing search. search. It's all right. Hang tight, chat. that says, like, passport access token denied. Passport, dude. Our passport has been revoked. Is that 90, we're 99% 90, resource usage right now. Jesus. Twitch, man. Twitch. Twitch.tv slash EasyLS. Take a little half, we're about halfway through. Take a little break. There we go. Take a little momentary break. Talking about... Stuff. He is my Street Fighter Five. Street Fighter. Pause. Talking about Resident Evil Three remake. What a gift. So how did you just, you just kept stretching this? Yeah. You know, if, yeah. If Resident Evil Three remake it has mercenaries mode, also, I'll be very happy. Give me that Merc mode. Merc me up. You know? You know, chat? Yeah, baby, just I see you. Up. I, I see, see you chat. chat. Uh, I see you. See you, chat. There really is no pop-out, huh? I see you. That broke it last time. Damiani, what have you done? Uh, we'll see. That passport callback. There it is. It broke it. No. What is this shit? No. All right, I see chat again. Chat. 
Welcome to the chat room. Chat. Are you here, chat? Chat. There they are. There There's they are. There chat. they are. Yes. Do we think Ari will be first person yes. again? We got chat back, Uber. Uh -huh. We saved it again. I think so. We did it, chat. We saved hell? you. Freaking internet gets so fixated on things, dude, and it like dominates. Wait, 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 what? What I missed? So the whole thing, the only thing people are talking about right now with Nemesis yeah. is its teeth and nose. What? Why? That's it. That's all anyone's talking about. It's like, oh my god, dude. I don't the teeth care. And nose? I don't give a shit about its teeth and nose. I think it looks creepy as hell. It looks unsettling. That's it. Huh. That's why, it. why the teeth and nose? Have you seen the picture? Yeah. Cause it just, it's just it's a weird. remake version. Yeah, it looks weird. It, I think it looks cool. I dig it. Okay, chat. Yeah, everyone's fixated on it. I didn't even know this was a thing. Yeah, I saw it on Twitter. If Twitter. Anything, my my. I initially, if I was to bet on what was potentially causing any outcry or controversy, yeah, I would have like guessed either Jill or. Either you know, the character's looks basically, <laughs> it's like. The, the, like, the hair there. I was like, I had to do a double take. Like, who's that again? Oh. Like, that's what they're supposed to look like? I was like, okay. Jill? No. Carlos. Yeah, Carlos. Carlos. Oh, you need to check the cash. Yeah, checking the cash. Check the cash. I mean, I'm glad people, I'm actually glad people are happy with Jill. A draw. How many do you have? Sorry. All right. See if we can t take out five hundred. Whoa, dude. Are you sure? You gotta get a mask. You need this. Here we're going to precisely the right amount. Like I said, I'm good with calculation. I can't hold that many. Oh shit, you can only hold 200 right now. All right, you can't do this yet. Okay. You gotta get the bigger wallet, okay. You can't do this one yet. I mean, you could do this one, but like this would advance the story. find this quest for you. Let's see if we can just do the, the big quest yet. Huber, mm -hmm. let's play the song of time. We're gonna do the big quest. Let's try the big quest. Say a lot of progress too, it's good. Cool. Cool, cool. Kingdom Hearts, dude. Every time. Alright, so you already got Cafe's mask. Okay. Cafe. Yo, when are they gonna put uh, Kylo Ren in Kingdom Hearts? <laughs> Kylo Ren in Kingdom Hearts. Like what the hell, dude? It's been too long. Hurry up. Um go to the uh turn into a Goron.
and go to uh, <laughs> or in Smash. <laughs> It'd be a better question. Yeah, in Smash. Yeah, uh, go to the Stockbot Inn. Video game characters, though. Yeah. Smash. Always forget that. My hype, my hype really gets away from me in, with Smash. I want to do this one. I want to test this real quick. Sure. Cool. Where am I going? Sorry. So, uh, Wait, we have to wait a sec. Okay. Turn into a Goron, though. Okay. And we're gonna wait till 2 p.m. Okay. <laughs> Reckless abandoned humor here. So fun. You <laughs> get those 50 rupees right here. Thunder, bring the thunder. Thunder. Yo, have you watched Looking for Alaska, Domiani? No. Do you have Hulu? No. Damn it. Never mind then. Cancel that as soon as one, we finish One Punch Man. <laughs> it's a good show, but it's sad. Uh, do I need to watch. Oh, crap. Uh, do I need to watch the film Arctic with Mad Smithson? Uh, I haven't seen good? that one. Okay. I know you don't have to watch Polar. Where he's like a p eye patched assassin. Oh, okay. Yeah, I've not watched that. I heard bad things about that. Yeah. Uh, if you want your Mads fix, you should just watch the Pusher trilogy. Okay. It's Nicholas Reffin's, like, one of his earliest movies, is Pusher. Dude, you know And there's three of them, you know and they're I phenomenal. You know what I watched the first time ever, pretty recently? Hmm. Drive. Drive? Yeah, sorry, Drive. Sorry, drive? drive. Yeah. First time? Oh, the driver, yeah, yeah. Dude, with, awesome. Uh, yeah, Gosling, yeah. Love it. Holy crap. Loved I it, did dude. not know what that film was going to be. Really? Yeah. Like, awesome. I, I thought, like, I was like, why is it called Drive? Because it was like, yeah. is there like racing or something? And then, yeah, I was like, oh, yeah, I man. get it, yeah. In another life, I was a wheelman. Yeah, I'd drive. Yeah. <laughs> Is this Huber? In a very dark life, I was a wheelman. Very wheel dark man. life. Yeah. The dark Huber trilogy. Yeah. <laughs> his dark, his dark, his dark materials Huber <laughs> edition. <laughs> Is that where the real version of On Green I'm going for it yeah. comes from? <laughs> it's not from Fast and Furious. <laughs> <laughs> Dark. Oh, I remember. Oh, I have to wait, right? Till yeah, I... till the one. <laughs> the hunt, Did dude. You... Some more mads. Ten yeah. out of ten. The hunt. Yeah. Pretty yeah, I would watch Pusher and the Hunt if you want a mads fix. It wasn't so much a mads fix as like, uh, kind of, like kind of. In... I saw a trailer or something about. Some film set in the Arctic, and I was like, "Oh, that seemed kind of cool." Like, like a researcher, and I'm like, "All right, okay. I, I, I'm kind of intrigued by this." Cool. Yeah. Chill. Yeah, I was watching. What was the one I watched where, uh, obviously, like a plane crashed, and like, there's a the guy gray. and a, a, what? The gray. A guy and a girl were on the plane, and one was like. You're just Elvin Kate Winslet. Yes. I forget the name of it. Yes, thank you. Yeah. Thank you. I was about to give you the actors. Like, <laughs> hey, what, it? Uh, what was it again? <laughs> gotcha. And then you find out, like, they weren't, like, that far from civilization, you know, but they never That's walked. That's the twist. Yeah, yeah they never, never walked. walked, but they do get, like, no, it's not lost. <laughs> it's not lost. <laughs> Stop with lost. Yeah, Fragile's in the new uh, 007, Anna. So, you see that trailer? I'm going to watch it. Later, okay. I don't. Never mind. I don't know what to say. Okay. But you haven't watched it yet, so you can't give me. I have not watched the trailer okay. yet, but I, I did watch, watch the Black Widow trailer. Okay. Yeah. 
Have you seen the new edit now of Stranger Things Season 3 with, uh... Hop oh, with, my with, God. Uh, yes. No, They've now not. done an edit where Hopper and Rush... <laughs> oh, my God. That's funny. <laughs> they said they already know about trailer jokes. Okay, chill, chill, chill. chill. Okay. <laughs> I don't want to spill the beans. <laughs> yeah. Did you watch Too Old to Die Young? Not yet. My dad did, he liked it. Okay. Gotta watch that, and I still never right, saw the Neon Demon as well. Uh, From Raffin. Yeah. I saw that one. Um, I was a little uneasy about maybe watching it, because I didn't know if it involved, like... It's like hypersexual, I know that. Yeah, like an underage person? I was like, mm, nah, 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 I don't know if we want to go here. But I don't know if the, it's the actors underage and they're supposed to be playing an older person. I was like, I should maybe look this up. Alright. Uh, turn into a Goron. Almost one. Turn into a Goron. And uh, just chill inside the Stockbot Inn. Which is... The, the Inn. To your left. Behind you. There you go. Here. There you go. And when it hits two, you get to talk to the person Got at the it. desk. Not yet, though. They're not back yet, so just wait. Hypersexual hunts. <laughs> what? Hypersexual hunts? Uh, did you know, Huber, I got to interview said director? Refn? Yep. No way. Yeah. That's awesome. Uh, I, I don't know how to pronounce his last name. I've always called him Refn. Yeah, Nicholas Wyndham Refn, right? Yeah. Um, pause for movies. a second, because it's almost time. I wanted to say this real quick. Uh, they were his, his family his was renting a house in L.A. because they yeah. were doing uh, filming for one of these the films that was that had come out. I don't remember which one. Didn't say. And only God forgives me. Was in uh, was shot it uh, in his like pool area, mm -hmm. and uh, the camera person I was with, uh, well known to us. Uh, Mike Buddy. Nice. Love Mike, Mike Buddy. Buddy with me. Shout out, dude. Mike and, Buddy. Uh, good man. Filming it. And, uh... Mike Buddy was with me in the infamous Huber interview t interviews Ted Price interview. Mike Buddy was the cameraman. <laughs> but go on. It was it Buddy? It was either Buddy or... Uh, Langdon? Uh, Lang yeah, it was one of the two. I'm forgetting now. It's been Got a while. It. Been a few years. Okay. There were so many interviews we did with so many different people in like okay. a week's time period. Anyway, doing the interview... And I believe it was, I'm pretty sure it was Buddy, because we're getting the shot set up, and, but, like, Mike was basically, like, it's, like, cloudy, like, it's, like, there's overcast, but it's not complete overcast, and it kept messing with the lighting, and he kind of tasked me, he goes, is there any way we can shoot this inside, like, it's really, like, it, like, I keep having to, like, adjust the, the lighting and stuff, and it's gonna look weird, Buddy dude. said that. Yeah, Buddy okay. said that. Yeah. So, we're all set down and everything ready to go, and I asked Nicholas, I'm like, hey, can we move it inside? He goes, no, out here is fine. And I tried explaining, well, uh, 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 I said, like, a uh, camera person said that, like, uh, with the clouds and stuff oh, where we no, are. I'm nervous about where this is going. And he literally just says, like, I've made films before. I know, like, the lighting's fine. <laughs> He probably was like, it was like his family looked like they were ready to go do something. So I think we were like, he was in a rush. So it's like, yeah, he doesn't want to wait. And he like, his family was inside. So I'm like, I think he just doesn't want us inside. Yeah. So it's like. He, maybe he yeah. just didn't have his coffee that morning. Yeah. And I, I he, he wasn't like a I jerk get, about it. Yeah, he was just yeah. like, hey guys, like, like, I was like, I think he's just like a little uneasy. So I was like, let's, I was like, let's just, I was like, just do it. Like, who cares? <laughs> NDK, dude. Yeah. I need a, I need a Ted Price salty run back, dude. In interview. I need it. <laughs> you know, Alright, so here we go, right? Huber. So. You know that one, Dummy Honey? What? I tried to interview Ted Price. Oh, I heard about this, yeah. It just didn't go well. Yeah. Uh, which is funny because, uh. When, when, when were we at his place? Uh, back at Game Trailers. Mm -hmm. Was it Fuse or would it have been on? Who, who would have been? What, what uh, game would it have been? I'm trying to it remember. It was Fuse, then Sunset Overdrive. So it was Fuse. It was, then, Fuse. Uh, it was definitely uh, it, it was Fuse. It was not Ratchet and Clank. And it wasn't For Sunset Fuse. Overdrive. And he, uh, who was with me? Was it? No, it wasn't. It wasn't. Uh, who was with me uh, that was there? And like, what? Oh gosh, who was it? 
I'm trying to remember which intern, uh, the, then intern at the time was, was intimidated. Living. No, like f- geeked out and at For the Ted end, Price or like, tried, yeah, me tried to like go and like get like an uh, autograph and stuff with him. At the That's end. not cool, dude. <laughs> an autograph and stuff. Who was like it? when you're working. That's not good. Don't say the name. Don't say the intern. Yeah, name. whoever it was. <laughs> Intern Lord. <laughs> I was just like, wait, what? <laughs> Alright, get ready to talk to the counter. Counter. Uh, talk. You can talk now. Stock pod. Answer in. yes. Yes. Hmm. Mr. Link. Mr. Link. Knife, Knife chamber. You got a key. Whoa. All right, so you got it, like, the knife chamber key. Okay. So, wait for a second, and a letter's going to be delivered. Okay. Back up a bit. Watch the sequence. Look at this. Look at oh, this. Nice. Talk, maybe? Talk, talk, talk. Try talking to them. Overhearing it. Yeah, here we go. Okay. Okay, uh, go around a corner and transform and put on the cafe mask and talk to her. Cafe mask? You moused over it. There. Read it. There it goes. So put that on and talk to her. Wait, wait, actually, wait a sec, wait a sec. Okay, yeah, talk to her now, it's, okay. Okay, so chill outside. You have to, cause she'll kick you out. Okay. But now you have the key. Okay. So, go outside. And uh, at, uh, at 11 o'clock, you're gonna go back in. You can play the song in double time to skip the six. Right, right, A, A, down, down. A right, right, A, A, down, down. But pay, yeah, pay attention to the story here. So she's looking, she's looking for this boy. So, and she got a letter saying, like, that upset her. Got it. So she's looking for this kid, and she got a letter delivered to her to upset her. So yeah, keep paying attention to this, yeah. She's not looking. Huh? Look, oh, turn around. Check this out. Go talk to this dude. You stole the reservation. What? What did I sleep on? That's so messed up. Yeah, you stole the reservation. That's Gabriel. sad, dude. I don't want to do that. Dude, this is like my favorite character in the game. So jolly. Sorry, dude. I go back in? Wait till 8.30. Okay. Then you can go back in. Dang. Cool bow tap. <laughs> so That's awesome. annoying. So awesome, dude. Yeah. It's funny because if you wait, wait around, you actually can see them come in later. Try and make the reservation, they have to leave. <laughs> and if you wait too long, then you try, it's like Corbin Dallas. It's like, oh, they already checked in. Like, you're not them. Like, get out of here. Dang. It's like a Corbin Dallas thing. <laughs> He'll get this reservation in another timeline, totally. <laughs> And then I, I really I, want the next phase of the Marvel movies, Damiani, to deal with the repercussions of meddling with time. Dude. That's what Doctor Strange yeah. is probably going to be about. I, I really want to see the consequences. They're probably, it's probably going to be like him reading the future. It's like, this is what happens, Strange. Yeah, dude. You know. It always trickles down somewhere. All right. Uh, so when it goes to 8.30, halfway point, try going in. Not yet. And then uh, go to the kitchen area. You'll have some time to find it. 
infinite timelines, infinite suffering. No, it's that. I mean, yeah. Uh, infinite timeline stuff is kind of scary. Yeah. Uh, so try and find the kitchen. Just chill here for a bit. You go in the hallway actually and look down the hallway. Here? Yeah, look down the hallway. Yeah, just chill here for a sec. Cool. Just uh, the power of uh, chill. time. Look at this. Real time. I'm afraid they'll scrap choices and do Jill or Carlos campaign instead. That'd be weird. Hmm. hmm. I assume Carlo's just gonna be like Ada though in Remake 2. Same thing. But even cooler, like, considering where he goes in the game. I think you have a really cool opportunity if you remake Resident Evil 3 to do Carlos's section. Pause. Awesome. Pause for a second. Uh, I think they said 11.30, by the way. What? They said 11.30 earlier. Yeah, but I think you have to go to the... Uh, I think you have to go to the staff-only room first. I think it's uh, upstairs. Maybe she's in here. Look around. Is she in here? No, 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 don't talk to them. Uh, yeah, go upstairs, maybe. It's a really cozy room. Uh, play the song of time, uh, inverted... Uh, Right. right A, down. Uh, down A, right, down, down A, right. A, down. Just to slow things down, because you don't want to miss this. I mean, it's such a big component of Remake 3. It'd be so bizarre if they, if they just ditched choices. Go upstairs. And I think, too, because them ditching the, the different the scenarios in, in Remake 2. I know there were other scenarios, but like... No, no, no. no. Not really. Wait, is that it? I don't know. No, that's the... Try the... This is your room. What's in that chest? Nice. Alright, yeah, go back out. You just wait. Just wait for her to come out. Basically, you're, you're, you'll see. It. It, it, there's something you need to get from her. So just uh, wait by that door. Over here. Oh wait, like upstairs door. Because oh, like okay. you can watch this. This is kind of cool. Like more of the real time stuff. I uh, can return time back to its normal flow. This door? No, no, no. Uh, just wait right there. Yeah. Okay. And then do a uh, down a right down a right. I can see a Resident Evil 3 demo shadow dropping. Yep, yep, Ooh, yep. that'd be nice. They like to do demos. They did it with 7 and 2. And even more before then, dude. Resident Evil 4 even. <laughs> Way back. And 2. Yeah, good, Resident Evil 2. good on the stairs, actually. Sorry. The Resident Evil franchise loves pre-release demos, so... Yeah, start heading towards the kitchen, actually. A kitchen, remake kitchen. 3 demo is a legitimate wish. Then wait right here. And a real possibility. I just hope it's not like they announce a demo at the Game Awards. Like, hey, stay tuned for a demo sometime next year. That would oh, be a bust, yeah. you know? Yeah, I'd not be happy with that. Okay, yeah. so she leaves now. Starts coming down. Shadow drop the demo, I agree. It's too perfect. Well. Talk. Oh, 
want. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Take it to a mailbox. Important promise. Mail that thing right now. Yep. Code Veronica remake? I mean, at this point, that's not out of the question. Yeah. Like, are they just going to remake well, that? Four? Remake yeah. every single Resident I, Evil game? Yeah, I don't think... <laughs> if you remake seven, it just happened. Remake it. <laughs> like, what would even I... What would a Resident Evil 4 remake look like, you know? I, I think this is yeah. visually improved again or something. Like, a. Uh... Did you deliver it? I think I have to equip it, yeah. Well, that may talk to it now. Yeah. Now, there you go. C button. There you go. There you go. Nice, super. Sweet. Alright. Feels good. Uh, you could uh, fast forward to 6 a.m. the next day. So, uh, right, right, down, down, or right, right, A, down, down. But, like, the blue point thing, like, it's getting more chatter because they said, like, oh, it's a PS5 project. It's, like, the most proud thing we've ever worked on, so it's, like... You know it's a Sony exclusive now. Absolutely. So it rules out any of the other crazy things. Uh, go crazy on, taxi. Yeah. Go on over to uh, the uh, the laundry pool. The place with the bell. Got it. Yeah. Smug Phil. What was that tweet? About VR? Is it about VR? I don't know. So, I uh, chill by the bench. Um, and we have normal time. Right? Yeah. Okay. So, uh, we gotta... Sorry, you gotta wait till 3 p.m. Cool. Metal Gear Solid remake. I, I, actually Metal Gear Solid, I feel like Metal Gear Solid is now a multi-platform. Yeah. Yes, the original one is only on PlayStation. What if it was an Uncharted 1 remake? The That'd most proud. Yeah. I mean, what were the theories? There was there was there was Demon Souls. Demon Souls is the best remake possibility ever. Make it happen. Let's go. Yeah, like what would uh I mean if it was Metal Gear Solid One complete like remake just for like just for PlayStation, like how does that work? Because there's the Twin Snakes that came on GameCube, and then there's the OG Metal Gear Solid on PlayStation. Neither has come out on another platform ever. It's like, is there some weird exclusivity with Metal Gear Solid One like going forward? Because Konami owns it. It's not Sony that owns it. It's Konami owns it. So. Mm -hmm. Konami would have a say, so... Yeah, and I think Metal Gear Solid would, like... Doing a complete freaking reimagining of that... Sub, with... uh, moon. Thank you. Appreciate it. Mo Donald? Mo Donald, appreciate it! Uh, yeah, without Kojima's involvement, it might be a little weird. Yeah. I mean, obviously it's not Final Fantasy VII, because it's all seven being exiting down Square Enix. Sorry, this is like driving insane. Wouldn't be Age Escape, would it? But like they said, like it's a big, like it's. They said that I think the wording was they're most proud of, but like hasn't also been said it's a big deal. We already got Shadow of the Colossus, so like, what else is a PlayStation exclusive that would be a big deal? 
God of War 1 remake. Dude, with Shadow of the Colossus vibes, man? Like, how big they... Dude, I see the parallels. What if they actually, like, did, like, the entire God of War collection? I like, could really see it. Everything pre-2018. I'm not even kidding. I could see... Because didn't they do the HD remasters? Yeah. Didn't they do those? I think so. Those are really solid remasters? Yeah. yeah. Like, the... Dude. 10k views on Prism Mummy. I hope people like it. It's giving me anxiety and keeping me awake at night. Last night, a free pick. Johnny Enders is also Konami. Dude, God of War 1 specifically remade would be really, really, really cool, dude. That'd be really cool. I could see it. In a second, I could really see it. Siphon filter. I'm glad you liked it. That means a lot, chat. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. But I've been so scared. Just didn't think people would be. I don't know. You know, you just, you doubt everything you do. You know, but like this one, I just I don't know. I was, I was nervous. <laughs> cool. Thanks, chat. The next ones are fun, too. Blue Point Chrono Cross. Hmm. Chrono Cross. That'd be so... It'd be so weird if Chrono Cross got remade before Chrono Trigger, you know? Right? Drangy and I, Shimu 3, enjoy it. Yeah, that Shimu 3 review should probably go up. I, I, I'm pretty sure Ian's cutting it, and I'm doing stuff with him today, later tonight. So I'm gonna guess like tomorrow ish that review will be going up. Oh no, wait. What time do we need? 1.30? Right, 3 o'clock? Okay, we're good. You know what I could have gone for, man? What? A Final Fantasy 1 remake. I can do that. I can take that. You know? The reimagining of Final Fantasy 1 would be pretty cool. Such an embarrassment of riches, dude. We're getting Final Fantasy VII Remake. Hey, Final Fantasy VII Remake! <laughs> That'd be cool! So like, oh give me them all, give me them all. Yeah. Let's do it. It's like, dude, Make the it Final... happen. Can you... Like, this is why I wish video game mm. development wasn't so secretive. Oh, Because I want to like know... Movies? I want to yeah. know how much money and how many people are working on the Final Fantasy VII Remake. Is it like a thousand people? Like Rockstar yeah. style, like are a thousand people working uh, like, on like, Final Fantasy. Remember the, like the original like trailer commercial stuff is like a cast of hundreds or whatever, like yeah. the, the over a crew, like a team of over a hundred people or whatever. It's like, yeah, it's probably like awesome. Yeah, there are right. so many people. So you gotta watch a sequence that happens here at three o'clock. So turn around. Yeah. Back up a bit. Do I want the bunny ears? No, you don't need anything. I you don't want gotta, this? No, you don't need any of this. You just gotta watch something happen at three. Look, here we go. Watch, the, watch this. Look at this. Just hang back and watch it happen. Pause. They say you want the bunny ears? No. It says he gets the letter and you go back in there. Chat, what are you talking about? I think someone just wants you to wear the bunny ears for wearing them for sake. Oh, you need to go inside. So go around. Yeah, go around. Go around. Go, go, go to the door. To the, the door over yeah, there? Yeah, the door that you can never open. Go in there okay. now. Don't run past them. Like, just go? Yeah, just go. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. 
Go in? Yeah. Just chilling here. Nice. Made it. I made it in. Made it Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, I, I'm pretty sure I remember that. Sorry. I'm reading someone else's instructions because I, like, just want to make sure we don't waste time. And they didn't say anything about this, so this guide's instructions don't mention you need to beat him in there. It says, it says, Meanwhile, Link hangs around the laundry pole until 3 p.m. on the afternoon of the second day. The postman delivers Link's letter to the young boy he saw on the first day. Following the boy into the door at the laundry pool leads him into a hidden room. So it says following the boy. So it's like you'd follow him in to talk. Secret keeper, dude. Ready, keeper? Showing gone, dude. Look out. Uh oh. I'll trade a boy or trade a man. So pause. As soon as it's done, pause. Or Ocarina. Hit the Ocarina button immediately. Ocarina. Uh, down A right, down A right. Did you play Fallen Order yet? No, I have to play that. That, that when we were in that conversation line, Fallen Order is probably next up on my list to try nice. and play. Yes, yeah, slowly current. Slow Are you gonna time. stream it? Probably not. All right, put on the bunny ears. You got them, and uh, make your way back to the end. Have we streamed Fallen Order yet? I don't think so. Dang. Oh, uh, I need to do a quick research break before we continue this. Okay. Hold, oh, hold, 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 hold. Oh, a little water, a little water. Yeah, twelve days of Domiana case is always like the greatest thing ever. Oh, because I'm playing it before then. I'm gonna get some more Life is Strange in over the holidays. We have some, uh, we have, yeah, we have some other streams happening over the holidays, actually. Uh, there's some, uh, not group streams, but there'll be other streams mm. uh, involving multiple allies, I believe. Unrealized hype, dude. Yes. Unrealized, unrealized hype. Yeah. I don't like leaks. Don't like I never leaks. will like leaks. It is up to the creators who created the thing to share it with the world when they want the only to. Only good leaks when they want to show it. The only I will good leaks are products be... that will that are canceled and would never happen. Yeah. Like knowing their existence. Yeah. Like I like hearing about like this was a canceled game. We would never have seen it, but this person leaked like videos about it. Like leaks that help, but like stuff like this, like but Resident Evil like, remake, like yeah, no, it's like, up to Capcom. I mean, yeah, it always happens. I like, I personally would prefer we get like the full surprise, because like it's good personal enjoyment. But at the same time, you know, and yeah, like it, it's if it, if it like if it hap like yeah, I, it's a weird balance because like I I think it's a. I've I've been on the side where it's like it's supposed to be like the it's the job of a journalist to report their findings, but like as I've watched more documentaries about stuff, there like here's a great analogy. Yeah. Okay, okay analogy because it's not the same in like level of like importance here. Yeah. But there have been times where presidents Dude, or okay. other major figures political have... leaks are way different than no, 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 video games. No 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 that's not what I'm talking about. Let's wait. Where they know a journalist has a story, and they said, like, you can break it. Like, we're not going to stop you, because we're not going to stop you, but can you wait? Can you wait until this point to do it? Mm. Like, so if, like, say, like, 
the site, like, Kotaku got, like, the new Assassin's Creed game. Yeah. And Ubisoft goes, hey, it's real. But could oh, you wait. wait? We'll give you a scoop totally. if you just wait until yeah. this day. Yeah. Like that, like that. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. Like, hey, you got us. Like, if they're trying to hide shit, then go go all out. You know, yeah. like, I'm not saying, like, you know, like, it's cool, like, try and buy them and buy their silence. <laughs> not that. I mean, I'm just talking about announcements. Yeah, dude. like, like announcements. Like, like, why, like, do people, like, I want, I mean, I'm not blaming either side because I don't know the full story. But, like, do they actually reach out to, like, Ubisoft? Like, hey, we heard about the new Assassin's Creed. Can you confirm it? I think they don't, do. Don't say anything to and them. Like, We're angry at them. It's people like... People refuse to comment and stuff. Well, it's like, be like, hey, like, could we if, we, if we talk to you about this, will you agree to wait till this date, you know? I don't know. I don't know enough about this stuff. Help me out. I guess there's also the argument if someone else knows about it, it's like, what do you do? Do you wait for that? Like, do you, do you try and beat them to the punch? You know, I don't know. They just need a logo from software. But part of this is also the one I think one of the problems is uh, like I know game development is not the same as movie making. It must I, I don't know if it's like right to say it must be nice to be in movie business then because in the movie business you can a just show a logo when you're doing an announcement like when Marvel announced like Blade. Here, here Blade, we're in Blade film, a new Blade film. Here's just a logo. It's coming at some point. No other information really about it uh, at the time. But like people get worked like they like people know X movie is coming out. That's not the secret. They're waiting for that first trailer. Set photos? So like so I basically think it'd be cooler if like company. Uh, the problem is if a company announces like let's say Final Fantasy VII remake was announced before they had the trailer ready because like hey we decided that we're gonna do Final Fantasy remake we're doing it like they hold a quick event and they're like hey we just want to announce Final Fantasy remake is coming more to come later but like what happens if that project gets canceled like don't companies like to wait until they know the project's like in a good place before they start showing it off like I, like that's why it's different from film like film it's like this film is pretty much happening like at a certain point. You start. You don't show a trailer until this thing's really happening. It's like, I wonder if it's more like trailer. Oh, start! No, 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 no! You need to go to the inn. Run to the inn. Out the door. Yeah, I don't like leaks. Run up. Uh, jump across this water. Yeah, there you go. Run up the ramp. Jones doesn't like leaks. Go. Keep going straight. Right. Straight. Up that ramp. And then you're gonna go left and into the door for the end on the left right there. Talk to her. Oh, you gotta give her the item. Put it on the C button, yeah, and then use it now to it. There you go. That face looks so happy. Alright, pause. Let me just, sorry, I forget. Jones prefers a well-crafted marketing campaign. So true. Okay, uh, warp to 6 p.m. double song of time. I remember Evil 
Within got hurt by the leaks. Remember that? Mm -hmm. Evil Within 2? Yeah. Oh, I may have to leave the building. I'm sorry. Uh, double summon time, sorry. Because you want to go 6 p.m. Because there's, there's two scenes that aren't required, but I, you should check them out. Cause it adds more to the narrative of this quest. Sick. Yeah. I'm invested. Yeah. So, you're going to go to your room now. On the second floor. You're going to wait in there. Any word on the Control DLC release date? Chat, you know. I saw they said they were pleased with sales because it had a low budget and everything. Up to the second floor, just chill in your room till 9.30. Nah, next door. There you go. And, uh, you'll be able to hear something cool. Uh, go to that green thing. That was on the wall, actually. Just behind you. That. Go to that. At 9.30, interact with that. Sick. Yeah, when it, come, when it comes to leaks, general of thumb, if, if, if you're spoiling, like, a, a fun surprise, like, ruining, if the, if it, like, would be the equivalent of, like, ruining a surprise birthday party, generally that's a bad leak. If it's any, if a leak that's gonna reveal the existence of something, like, important information that, like, would otherwise have never been known before. Mm. Those are good leaks. Mm. So, any, 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 yeah. That'd be my general rule of thumb. Anthem is the eighth best selling game of the year. Only reason Control is happy with the sales is probably because of how much they got going with the Epic Store. Help them. Hope Control does well. Yeah, I feel like some leaks are intentional, though, chat. Did you play Control? No. It's another game I have to play, try and play. Like, weirdly kind of divisive nowadays. Yeah, that's like I've where control some, is heard, in the narrative, right? At I mean, this I, moment, I don't. I haven't I've heard complaints some, like, about the narrative. It's mostly been about control jank. Yeah, I've seen people be like weird about it. Like, huh? What? Control's so sick. Oh, play the inverted song of time to speed See? time back up. Sorry, this is extremely slow. I've seen like two separate cases in the last week where people were like, oh, I just couldn't get into control. Couldn't get into it. Tried really hard. Uh, Do you say double? Yeah, sorry. No, 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 inverted. Uh, down A, right, down A, right. That is every game. That's true. Every game. There's like an initial hug. I'm also of the uh, I'm also the opinion you don't need to play every game. Yeah. You're right. Like I think you could play, try and play too many games, even in our profession. Yeah. It's like I saw someone saying like a one week uh, a professional reviewer should have a one review a week mentality to be like efficient. I'm like, what? I was like, you're on crack. So like that is not a very healthy opinion. In Movies maybe. Yeah. It's like you can maybe do a movie, yeah. You can do a movie like, once a week. I was like, it, do, it also depends on the game. Like if it's short, like if it's under ten hour game, okay, maybe yes. Yeah. But not every game's in, like that, like that. That's like, that's like insanity. Yeah. Not all, vi not all video game reviews are the same, but all movie reviews kind of are. You know, because it's like a movie's either ninety minutes or it's The Irishman and it's three and a half hours, mm -hmm. like. It's a two hour difference at most. You know? Yeah, Whereas a game can be like. That movie's also getting like praise, but like uh, the Anna Paquin stuff, like people trying to say, like, oh, underutilized and stuff. That's the point. Be Never mind. Yeah, I know. I, I don't know. want to talk Robert about De Niro it. tried to defend it. He was like, yeah. uh, well, okay, everyone's entitled to their opinion. Yeah. You know, I thought this was 
did a great job and yeah. this was the point, but yeah. you know, yeah. I'm not gonna argue. You know, I'm also not the director, so you know, yeah. hey, hey, yeah. hey, yeah. hey, it is what it is. It is what. It that's what he said. It is what it is. That's what he, the exact words. It is what it, it is. It is what it is. I'm trying to help you. I'm trying to help you. You understand? I'm trying to help you. I'm just concerned about your well-being. I'm it just trying to help you. It is what it is. But I was told to say, it is what it is. Well, he's uh, a boss. Go to uh, 930, interact with that. They'd only agree to this if you were in it. This suspecting that lady suspects he ran off with another woman. The mom, look at that mom's advice. Wow. Uh, make your way to the bomb shop. This is an involved side quest, yeah. dude. Holy moly. These are optional. Like that's Would just, have never known. That's just, that's just adding to the stakes here, Hubert. Yeah. You don't have to actually ever watch that to advance the story. It's really cool. I like that cutscene. That was a good one. That was probably, yeah, that was most of a mature cutscene yeah. in Zelda game. Yeah, that was great. Bomb shot, bomb shot. Other side, other side. Ooh, yeah, this, this quest blew me away back in the day. Just yeah, how involved it was, and yeah, the all these a lot of these quests, even the shorter ones, felt like so meaningful. And just hang out in here until it'll be one a.m. You're gonna see a scene. You don't have to talk. You just hang back. Was this the first game of Bunny Ears? No. Uh, you get them in Ocarina of Time. Was that the first game? Yes. Well, you can turn it into a bunny in A Link to the Past. Mm, you got it. Very cool. Whoops. Do you like Hero Warriors, Damiani? It's guilty pleasure, the like goofiness. I'm not sure, I'm not versed enough in Muso games to say how good it is in the ranks of the Muso genre. Um, so, beyond that, like, I think you get a lot more out of it being, a, like, into Zelda. <laughs> yeah. Like, it's definitely fan service. I'm actually unsure about this one. I forget. I don't remember seeing this one. But it says at 1 a.m. the there's gonna be a, a delivery that happens, and some uh, uh, coffee uh, coffee observes it. But I think they observe it from the curiosity room. So I don't know if you have to be in here or in the at, at room. I, I'm not sure. Okay. So if nothing happens at one, I might have you slow down time and run to the other room real quick and see if you could like get the cutscene. I'm not entirely sure, yeah, fortunately. Yeah! Do you need to be outside the room? I forget. Like, do you need to be on the street? Or, do you, or, can, you, or can you be in here? The room of requirements. Okay, uh, hit... Stop. Uh, hurry, uh, do the song. Uh, down A right, down A right. And then, uh, run back to the pool room, the room with the uh, area with the bell. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, run back there and go into that door. Sorry. 
I don't know if it's too late. Yeah, you can try it. It's just a scene. You don't. It's not. It wasn't imperative to. I'll uh, go up the stairs. Yeah. yeah jump across the water. And go in the door. Oh. Guess not. Uh, basically, Kafe it, it says that's the person who stole the, uh, the, the, the wedding mask. Oh, the mask. That's all. Got it. So, uh, Dang just it. warp, warp to 6 a.m. next day. Double song of time. And, uh, hang out by the pool. play uh, the inverted song time because we slowed down time. Yeah. Let me turn it back to normal. So we just gotta wait till 1 p.m. And then you're uh, gonna go into that, that door, the door that was locked. You can go in there at 1 p.m. Cool. Dino fatality, dude. Hey, Come on. <laughs> I mean, that's Come cool on. to see. Yeah, but like a remake, it's like, nah. Like of a game. I mean, it was fun playing through Truck 1 again, but, uh. I don't think it needs a remake. It is what it is. It is what it is. Alien vs. Turok. <laughs> Come on, Chad. <laughs> that's really good. It is what it is. But it you is. need to tell him. Turok. Turok. Bring Turok I back. I am Turok. You that remake are is like, Turok. The reboot was swimming in sevens. I am Turok. It had one of the worst shotguns in video games. I think I've told you this. What? Yeah. Really? It's like a pistol. Okay. Yeah, it's terrible. I forgot about this. The reboot. Cool knife kills, though. Kill it with a knife. Alright, I'm going back to the one of these masks. I just want to see if, uh... Oh, I to rock. Let's see if we can get the stone mask still or not. I forgot about that. Dinosaur Hunter. Oh, this requires something way later. Anyway. Yeah, I played the Turok on GameCube. It was disappointing. Three was disappointing. GameCube one was disappointing. Evolution, right? Turok Evolution. Three in Evolution, disappointing. Reboot, nah. One and two, for sure the best. And Rage Wars. One, two, and Rage Wars, dude. All right, uh, Do you think Rage Wars holds up, though, chat? Play the inverted song of time. Probably not. Real quick. As much as I wanted to. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna do something. Have you do something that'll make part of this a little bit easier. Scribble so board. Do you like the cerebral bore, Damiani? The what? You ever use it? Turok Rage Wars? You ever play it? I never it? played anything but Turok 1. Okay, in Turok Rage Wars, there's, there's a weapon called a cerebral bore, and okay. it's like a, a heat seeking thing, and you shoot it, and it like ejects this thing, and it lands on the uh, person's head and like sucks their brain out. What the? <laughs> it like destroys their brain, yeah. <laughs> Cerebral bore, dude. Oh, wow. 
Uh, so, is, th is there a potion shop here? I forget. I forget oh, uh, go to, uh... Chat, what's the easiest way to buy a red potion? The, the Southern Swamp, or... Is there a shop here? I forget. Go, uh... Go real quick to the shops area and see if the shop has a red potion. If not, I'm happy to go to the Southern Swamp. We cool. have enough time. Cool, cool, cool. We're gonna get you a mask that's gonna help you out with the last part of this. Sick. Yeah. The left, back, back, back. No, wrong way, wrong way, completely wrong way. We're going southern? No, we're going to the the, sh the market area. Oh, right. Yeah, not the bomb shop, but Got there it. should be a normal market. I don't know if they sell red potion here or not. Got it. Got if it. not, we're going to the southern swamp. Got it. Got it. Got it. Uh, check these two stores. I forget which one has it or not. That looks like potions, maybe. Yeah. yeah. Nope, that's curiosity shop. Go up to the next one. I don't think they sell it, but I just want to double check. Uh, fairy arrows, deck. Ah. Yeah, they're red potion. Okay, buy a red potion. Okay. I'll buy it at a high price. Okay, right, leave. Uh, hit start. Uh, put it on. Uh, okay, cut. Cool. Uh, buy another one just in case. Because I always forget the timing of when you give it to him, and you might accidentally use it instead of giving it to the person you need to give it to. All right, cool. Uh, leave and go east, out the east way. East, heading east. No enough cash. Yeah. yeah, not enough cash. And then when you go outside east, uh, yeah, I guess. Uh, play Epona's song. Here. Yeah, and get the horse. Sorry, I'm just getting you a little bit. You're gonna go a little bit into the n new area you haven't been to yet, Huber, but. Not that far. You just need. I just need to get one thing that'll help you out. Okay. Mount up and ride east. Vikings final season so hyped. Last season was a little inconsistent. I can't jump over that. You know, it's been on, you know, no spoilers, but like, you know, jump over this a big one. thing happened a while ago and uh, jump over this next one. the show hasn't 100% reached those heights that it's capable of. I'm really hoping the final season gets it back to, to, to what I believe it can be. It's still been good. All right, get off. Especially with the addition of Jonathan Reese Myers as Bill of Uh, you need to dismount and use the Lens of Truth. Okay. But yeah, I'm hoping. Ah. Oh, no, 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 no. You don't want to do this yet. Yeah, sorry. Hey, it's the story stuff. I, I was trying to save it. Heavy stuff. A little later. Alright, put on the lens of truth. Activate it and uh, look around with it on. There should be a hidden soldier right to your right. There you go. Talk to them. Yeah, you have to have it up. This is cool. Dude. Many years. What? Sick. There you go, Haber. Nice. Got it right. Dude. 
sack boy. Sack boy mask. Yep. Shiro the stone soldier, dude. Nice. I really want them to go souls with this, and this guy helps you in the final boss fight. He's <laughs> so awesome. This guy shows uh, up. Link! I'm here! <laughs> There's the... Alright, uh, turn off the lens of truth, and uh, put that mask on one of your items. Basically, when you use this mask, let me explain it to you. When you wear it, you're basically invisible to uh, characters. Alright, uh, head back to town. Uh, Song of Soaring. So I can like sneak in places? Invisible yes, style? that's important, yes. Alright, right, let me head back to the cafe instructions. Cafe. Cafe. Cafe, 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 cafe. <laughs> Sorry, for the longest time it said uh, cafe or cafe. So saying coffee, which is cafe. It's cafe. Cafe. But like, my mind fights against that pronunciation. So, so, like, it took the longest time to say Kakariko instead of Kakariko. Kakariko Village! I used to say Kakariko, and I could not undo It took a long time to undo that. What's your favorite town in Zelda Domiani? Go to the pool. The laundry pool. Oh, <laughs> favorite town in Zelda. Well, let me see. We had so many to choose from. What's your favorite? <laughs> Name it right now. I mean, my favorite theme is the. Uh, no, what's your oh. favorite town? Go now. Name it. Don't think. Answer. I don't know. You have to go. Think about simple it. question. <laughs> it's not so simple. It's a simple question. It's not so simple. Just uh, chill by the door. I don't wanna. And uh, return the flow of time to normal. Blood is a new thing. Japanese say Kohi. That's how you pronounce the English version of this name? Long Run Ranch is not a town. I'm gonna go with Terry Town. I mean, Otana, Kakariko maybe? and A Link to the Past is probably my favorite. There it is. We got him, chat. We got him. Alright, now 1 p.m., the door will unlock and you can hit it. Up that moon. I can't see just yet. Here, better angle. There it is. Jeez. The moon. It's freaky. I really hope the moon talks at the end, dude. Don't tell me if it does, but it better. I'll be disappointed if this moon doesn't speak. I don't like Born on City in Ocarina of Time. Our town in Minish Cap, I think, is pretty good. It's a very, yeah, it's a very complicated, loaded question for me. Never played on the third day because the moon was too scary. Oh, <laughs> just bail out. Yeah, reset, <laughs> reset. I would agree. I think Twilight Princess is some of the worst towns. The starting village, Orden Village, is not very good, in my opinion. Uh, head inside. Whatever. Wait. Okay, now. And talk to the dude inside. You better check this out. With the sound mask? Uh, turn it off. Take it off. What? What in the... Pikachu mask. Nice. <laughs> the kid was like, it's a Pikachu mask. Mask of memories. <laughs> the Keaton mask. The Pikachu mask. Alright. So, uh, go outside and we're gonna slow down time because we really need to slow down time after you read this. 
Sakon. I always said Sakon, but I guess it's Sakon. Sakon. Yeah, head outside and slow down time. There's a few things we need to do. Sakon. One last research break. Alright, yeah, we're in the final stretch of this quest, Huber. Oh, we'll hit this just to make sure we do this. Yeah, pause. That face that we froze Link on was pretty good, chat. How's it going, chat? How's your day? Going well? I now read the smug Phil Spencer tweet. Phil, uh, from Phil Spencer, and it started. This week, I brought my Project Scarlet console home, and it's become my primary console. Playing my games, connecting to the community, and yes, using my Elite Series 2 controller, having a blast. Great work by the team. 2020 is going to be an incredible year. <laughs> Must be nice. I'm the head of Xbox. I got a Scarlet at home. I'm playing, I'm playing a Scarlet. Let's take some photos. <laughs> uh, someone at Sony should like immediately tweet should tweet back at Phil Spencer immediately being like, well, I'm just over here at home with my PS5. It's become my primary console. <laughs> <laughs> Playing with my new dual shock. <laughs> uh, I was reading the Phil Spencer thing finally. Throwing I was like, shade. oh my gosh. I said like Sony needs someone at Sony needs to read, like tweet at him a reply saying, Yeah, and I'm just chilling here with my PS5 is my primary console now, all cozy. Alright, uh head to the mayor's office. So you remember you talked to the mom there? Yep. You gotta give that letter to the mom. Cool. I think. Either give it to her or you put it in a mailbox. I forget which it is. We'll try giving it to her directly. <laughs> I'm playing Death Stranding 2. <laughs> <laughs> It's begun. I'm sitting here Would it be playing hilarious Death Stranding if, 2. If it got so out of hand, they started tweeting like secrets and stuff. Wrong way, I think. Sure. Yeah. You're right, you're right. They start tweeting, well, I'm playing like Bloodborne oh. 2 and like... No, no, no. This is the wrong side. You're wrong, completely wrong side of town. Mayor's office is over by like the inn and stuff. Up the rim? Yeah, it definitely kind of comes off like a humble brag. And in there. There it is. A little, not for a mayor's office, I was expecting a little bit more. On the outside. I guess to the right. Right? Is this her door? Yeah. Oh my god, go on. I don't know if she's still here or not. Uh, I forget where she is. Try, uh, try the, damn, where is she? Just go to a mailbox, I guess, and mail, no, I don't know if it'll be delivered in time. Go for somebody says. All right, get a milk bar, okay. I, I don't think I remember doing this part. The, giving the letter, it's not required. It's just optional for more lore building. Don't mailbox. Uh, I was afraid, wrong way. Wrong way. Other side of town? That way, milk bar is right there. Oh, it's right here. Here. 
Are they at the... If you give it to her, you miss a mass, so we shouldn't give it to her? So put it in a mailbox to get the mask. Okay, put it put it in the mailbox. Okay. Okay. We gotta do this right, dude. I'm into this. Left. There you go. And then you gotta yeah. You sure? Just do it, yeah. And it's not needed for finishing the quest. Okay. Oh, you gotta go to the post office. Uh, go to the other side of town. You gotta hand it to the mailman. Oh, there there he is. Damn it. Maybe you have to get to him directly. Oh, shit. Uh, go go uh, check his schedule. On the final day. Okay, we'll give it to him after. Don't uh, don't worry about this. Uh, go go east. Go back to the the haunted uh, valley place where you got the stone mask. Okay. And go there. Also, uh, it, yeah. And a pony ride over and all that stuff. Yeah. We're just gonna get you in place for the finale. That's it for side quests. For the finale, this this side quest. Got it. And I will give you a heads up. This part is uh, at least the stone mask will make the first part. Uh, shouldn't be a problem. <laughs> the second part. Uh, let me just say, like, this is why this is a like, uh, it's a really great quest. Uh, there's a there's ways to fail this quest. I have to do it all over again. All right. So ride. Yeah. Um, Oh, you old nag. Red Dead, remember that? What, Red Did Dead? Did you play Red what? Dead 1? What, Red Dead 1? Uh, only played uh, DLC for... Uh... Did you play GTA 5? Yeah. So you like GTA, but just not Red Dead that much? Oh, uh -huh. so driving around in cars faster and riding around on horses in the middle of nowhere. So it's the horse that gets you. I mean, I enjoy Western setting stuff, yeah. but like I'm not like it's not like my favorite setting. So that has yeah, that, but like if I'm gonna do exploring a giant world, like I want fantasy. God. And like Red Dead, like it. Yeah. I mean, there's also more interest. You could do like something. I love Western. Okay. Uh. So stop. 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 Get off. You ever seen Unforgiven, Damiani? Yes. So there are some great Western things I do love. But like Western video games haven't really been it for me. All right, so remember the dude on the wall. It's time to interact with them. So with this mask, cause he looks like him. Oh, nice Uber. Let's try this. <laughs> the leader of the ninjas. For Stokage. Oh. Dude, reanimation jutsu? Oh. Ooh. Dude, wood jutsu it is! Dude, for Hokage vibes. It's going what, down. What, what, do you, what can you do to uh, something like that? You want to go that way. This way? Yeah, so what? something just appeared, so. Yeah, where, did, where was that? It up, was up there. This? No, no, look up. It's on the... the oh, the hookshot, the hookshot, dude. The oh. hookshot. The hookshot, the hookshot, the hookshot. There you go. 
make your way forward. Uh, I would, uh, oh, dude, these enemies. Uh, equip the stone, take this off and put on the stone mask now. And don't take off the stone mask. I'll make you invisible. And you'll see why. Not for, it's not happening immediately, but like, it's damn. Just getting wrecked by boulders here. Whoa. So, uh, you're gonna... That. Well, you just saw. You're gonna go there. No. No. Uh, this way, yeah. Chill behind those rocks. Here? Uh, no, no, the pile of rocks over here. Chill behind them. Talk, yeah. Oh, take off the mask. Undo, uh, no, you can't go in yet. You said you have to wait. Yep. So go back to where you were just standing, just to be extra safe. Uh, and play the inverted song of time, and you're gonna wait till 6 p.m. Song of double time? No. That's the wrong one, right? No. Definitely no. 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 Yeah. Inverted no, no, no. song of time, sorry. Yeah, if you go, if you skip the six, you're too late, and you'll miss it. Chill. All right. When it turns to when it when it hits five, uh, slow down time again. No, if you skip the six, you're late. I think I've done it before. You're late. If you skip the six here, I'm pretty sure you're, you're you don't get to go in. It's over. Because I'm pretty sure I've done that. On my first ever time I tried to do this side quest back like 19 years ago, I'm pretty sure I did that and it ruined it. And I had to redo everything. Uh, maybe I'm wrong. I thought it. it Something I wore. No, was it? Maybe it was the. Uh, some. Maybe it wasn't this quest. There's some quest where it says it happens at that time, and then you warp to it, and you're too late. Might have. Maybe it was like the ghost mini, the alien invasion one. It might have been the alien invasion. Yeah. Stop moving. Uh, you go ahead and slow down time again. And yes, and then just chill here. Cool. And then uh, angle the camera towards the door so you can see the front door or the stone door. Yeah, and then chill. Yeah, here we go. Oof, there'll be a cutscene that plays. Cool. Yeah, this is. Love this. Thieves' hideout. Taking a knee. Taking a knee. It's so cool because if you so, so to do in order for all this the set of events you did Huber yeah that was so, you remember there was a, a night where you actually stopped the thief with the bombs and you got the bomb mask the blast yeah, mask yeah 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 so that's that's the thief if uh, you, yeah, yeah. but if you if you intervene there yeah you can't do this quest line. Because he doesn't deliver the stolen goods. So you have to, re which you have to do it on different cycles. We didn't, you didn't get to see that scene. That's when I messed up for you. Got it. But like, if you were there, you witnessed him finally delivering the stolen so goods. So cool. And that's how he finds out where he is and stuff. Yeah. That's really awesome. 
And like if you're late, like if you don't make the reservation, you can't do that. Yeah, you just take a sword. Like, Huber did that. He slashed him with a sword. It was great. Slash! And he just, like, walk, runs off like, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna get out of here. I'm safe. It's like, I just slashed you with your sword. How are you not dead? He just runs off like, he walks it off. He walked it off. He walked it off. Rubber he walked it off. He walked it off. He was a little evil. Glad we are helping entertain you, cheering you up, GBMs. Uh, GBZMR, I apologize. Wait, oh yeah, you could blow up the bag and he just vanishes. Man, you, you really could kill him. Here we go, here we go, Huber. Chill. Uh, I, yeah, here we go. So, uh, exile first person. Just chill here. You can hold down Z if you want a better angle, yeah. Here we go. The thief. They stole it from us. My precious. Precious. Filthy little thief. Takes it from them once the hobbitses are dead. So intense. He's just strolling up right now, the the thief. Oh gosh. I'm just hidden. Blending in with this rock. Camo, dude. Snake eater. Snake! What a thread. <laughs> yeah, I guess he could have warped to this time because I guess he takes a sweet time walking up. It's all good, man. <laughs> Curb it next month, do you see that? Yep. We know you're tired of waiting. Or we know you're waiting. Do you ever wish you could be as funny as Larry David? No. Okay. That'd be a burden. That'd be a burden. Uh, Chad, I'm ready to take this long. Don't move, though. Uh, what's going on? Why are you taking so long here? There we go, there we go, here we go. Oh. Get ready. Just wait. Just taking a peek. Alright. Dude. Wait. Follow him in. Yeah, yeah, but just wait. Alright, head in now. Get on in there. So. Huber, check, go. You in the hideout? Yeah, check it out. Yeah, you can't break your ass. Dude, Indiana Jones? Dude! It's a trap! Step on the switch. Okay, hey, pause. So I'm gonna explain one thing to you. Okay. You will be toggling back and forth. Not you don't get you don't have a toggle command. It will change back and forth at certain points between Link and Coffee. No way. Link does combat Whoa. and you do puzzles. Your goal is to push 
those blue switches. Yeah. You gotta keep advancing the way for each other before the mass reaches the end, or it's GG. So push the, one of those in. No, no, no. Yeah. You gotta figure. Try another one, try another yep, one. Yep, yep. Shit. Grab it. Try pushing it in. Oh. There you go. Kill... Kill that thing real fast. Yeah. Kill this thing really fast. Okay. Yes. Get to advance. Go, go. Pause. No oh, god. Red switches are bad. Yellow switches are good. Okay. You want to step on the blue switch is ultimately what you want to step on. Okay. Good, good, good. Very good. Hit the blue switch. Very good, Huber. Next room. Kill. Nice, Huber. Don't touch the red switch, but yeah, go, go. Don't touch, don't touch, don't touch. Good, good, good. Uh, push that one. Yeah. Push down. No, no, no. This one. This one? Pause. Oh, no. Um. Pull it back, maybe? Pull it okay, back. Okay, go, go to the far right. No, 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 go far right. Push this down. You are going to hit the red switch, but don't worry. All the way? Push, push this, no, 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 push the middle one left. You're gonna push onto yellow switch, but you're okay. gonna hit the red first, but then push this right. There you go, now push down. Sorry. Nice. This one is where everyone is. Yeah, loses. for sure, Sorry. dude. I'm glad you just told me, dude. Z, hold Z target. So you're facing him. I'm trying. Z target. I'm trying. There you go. Alright, you're gonna hit that switch, you're fine. Hit the that. There you go, Huber. Nice. Go, oh, go. Oh. Nice. Job, Huber. It's sick. Sorry. So all, I mean, fast. all I was gonna have him do is I was gonna like have him pause the screen on that puzzle thing and be like, think this out. Yeah, what do you, you, you got can it? totally. What do you got it? You can pause. You can totally pause. You can totally pause. All right, Huber. Your final thing to do. It's not over yet. Sun mask. Song of Soaring Warp back to the town. Uh, I have no time, dude. You see this? No, I know. This is the this is the point. Okay. Soaring over California. Yeah, warp to uh, Song of Soaring. Are you going to the post office? Clock time? Yeah. Clock time? Is the postman a good movie? Does it hold up? Did it ever? What? The postman? It's an interesting watch. I, watch I don't think it holds up as well on subsequent viewings. Uh, All yeah, right. this way. Yeah, that way. This way? Yeah, take off the mask. Go into the first door. Here. Mm -hmm. So the only st uh, he's like in here somewhere, I believe. There you go. Whoa. Look at that. Give him purpose, Huber. Restore order to his chaos. This thing. Yep. Here you go. Highest. All right. So now, Huber, you will need to go to the employee-only room and stock pot in. Got it. Which is on the other side. Yeah. So I'll explain why this is also not what you're doing, but why this whole quest is also tedious. You technically, if you want 100% complete this game, you have to actually do it twice. Whoa. Because there's a bottle you can only get. 
So you had a choice there, Huber. Yeah. Give the postman... I'm sorry I took the choice away from you. It's okay. Postman for a mask, or go into the inn, in, 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 or you go to the milk bar and personally deliver it to the mom. Got it. You personally deliver it to the mom, you get a bottle. Oh. If you do the mail, you get no a mask. Way. Give it to the mail, dude. Yeah. Give him purpose. Up to the second floor. I want to do his job for him. Here you go. Here? Yeah. Oh. And now, chill. RP, dude. In my head, I'm sitting in this chair. Should I take their stuff? Sure. You'll have to, you can go run and deposit that. Go deposit your rupees, actually. You have time. Right now? Yeah. And use the bunny hood. Yeah. Make it fast. Make it cash. It's on the other side, though, now, right? Yeah. Dang it. Let's go through there. Run straight across. Oh, and talk to the postman on your way back. That was... Uh, let's do this. He'll be... It's go. right here, right here, right here. Go, go, go! Yeah. Deposit those rupees. Nice. And then, yeah, when you literally go back the way you are, he'll be, like, along that path. There you go. Alright, head back the way you went. There he is, yes. down. Talk to him. Yeah, in front of him. Front. All the way in front of him. Wait, chat, pause. How do you talk to him then, chat? Okay, wait till he delivers it. Okay, yeah. Okay. Just follow him, okay. Just meet him at the end? Yeah, yeah, just meet him at uh, the bar, actually. The milk bar? Yeah, the milk bar. You gotta get your. I'm sorry. Yeah, you gotta get your reward. <laughs> you don't need any of this. Oh, okay. Yeah. I guess you do. <laughs> well, I mean, after he goes in. Yeah, after he goes in, it's unlocked, I believe. Just wait here. Or down there. Yeah. That's so goofy looking. Uh. Mm, just, just nibbling on, on the shield. It's very tasty. Very tasty. Is that a hint of zinc? Iron ore? Dude, backflip down the stairs. What up? Yo. Showing the postman how to do his job. Just follow him out, follow him out. Just go out, postman. Whoa. Right into the void of nothing. 
something. Follow him out to the... He's gonna go out here. He's just gonna stop outside. Look up while you're waiting. Check out what the soldier's looking at. It's really close. Yeah. He stops before leaving. Yeah, yeah, sorry. And then you get to talk to him. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Yeah, there you go. I have decided to flee. I'm now free! He's starting a Patreon. Nice. Sick, dude. Postman's hat. <laughs> Public service. Look at that! Look at that! <laughs> <laughs> Freedom! <laughs> Go to the inn. <laughs> Go back to that uh, second story room. <laughs> oh, that's good. All right, and here you go. And you get to wait here until one hour, 30 minutes left on the clock. Whoa, okay. Whew. Yeah. Intense. This Very. music, part of this music is in uh, the Wind Waker. When you beat a boss and the little vortex of swirly stuff to warp you out appears, the portal. Uh, it plays kind of like the howling noise mm. in the background of this. There's a moment in Attack of the Clones where the music is the Game of Thrones theme song. Wait, wait. Check out, dude, Google it. Similarities. So the Attack of the Clones is a Game of Thrones song? In Attack of the Clones, Star Wars Episode 2 Attack of the Clones, there is a moment near the end of the movie when they're showing all this, the clone troopers. For like two bars, it does. -ni 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 -ni. I'm not even kidding around. I'm not even kidding around. So Attack of the Clones, you say? Yeah, look it up. Attack of the Clones, Game of Thrones. Like, Google them together, and there's, like, a video, probably. It was so blatant that Beth and I noticed it at the exact same time. We both were like, yo! Like, one of those things. See, dude? Dude, it's there, man! I don't know. I mean, Are you like this? It's identical! It's identical. Uh, okay. It's That's not fan made. No, that's in the movie. I watched the movie last night, and that exact. I mean, I feel like it's a beat common. Happened. Yeah, like what I literally the watched last night. Like the speed, I think matters too. Yeah, it does. It does. I mean, if it was like, <laughs> like the person. Oh, you hear about this? Like, talk about similarities and potential plagiarism. You see the mm -hmm. the Sony ad that had to get pulled. No. Because it had like straight up was like frame for frame ripping animations from like Steven Universe and like independent students from Japan Whoa, and stuff. Oh dude, what? Yeah. It was a uh, holy crap, yeah. The question I mean, the question was did they uh, like did they hide it because they were the video was put up too soon and they actually coordinated with those people to like it's like intentional references where they Already got permission and stuff, or was it actually blatant plagiarism? Uh -uh. It's crazy. Yeah, it wasn't Sony that made it though. They hired someone to do it for them, so they might have just been like made aware of it and were like, "Oh shit, uh, what is this? Not good." Are you gonna watch one through eight before nine? I mean, already we watched everything. Got it. Uh, I mean, like, literally we watched them again going into when it. When was the last time you rewatched them? Like, two weeks ago. Oh, well, that counts. Yeah. So can, yeah. <laughs> like two, I mean, yeah. Did, when did, the first thing when Disney Plus exactly. dropped yeah. is I w started watching all the Star Wars Like, if you've watched, then. if you've watched one through eight within the last, like, year, oh, okay, that's okay. fine. Yeah. I just, I haven't seen them in a couple years. Couple, yeah. No, it'd been a long time since I'd seen the original trilogy. Yeah. 
Yeah, it was uh last time I did one through six was before Force Awakens. I didn't do it for Oof. Last Jedi. I just watched Force Awakens before I saw Last Jedi. But for nine, dude. I mean I gotta do them all. Yeah, I did Force Awakens, did uh the last Last Jedi and Jeez, bringing titles already, the new ones. Solo is after three before four, right? Yes. But Rogue One is It's also before three. It's immediately uh, after three, but right before literally right before right four. Before is Rogue One. It leads into the start of episode four. It's, but so it goes solo, then Rogue Solo's One. Solo's before Rogue One, yes. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. It's about like ten years before I've Rogue only one. seen both of those movies one time each. Yeah, Solo's only 10 years before. I rewatched Solo. Um, it was a little bit better than I remember on my first um, my I first viewing. It. Yeah, it was uh, I just don't like the guy, the actor. Uh, not, I, I, I don't like the actor's portrayal of yeah. Han Solo. It doesn't feel like Han Solo. And it, it, it takes it out. Everyone else, yeah, great. I love Woody Harrelson's line like, the smartest thing you've done, kid. I would have killed you. Yeah. It's like, damn. Good in that, dude. Here we go. 30 seconds, Uber. 30 seconds to Mars. Till uh, the event. 30 uh, seconds of the moon crash. Hold Z. See if it gives you a better level angle. Yeah, uh, like. <gasps> that's alright. No, you can move. Like, look at the door. Yeah. Like, get an angle where you can see, like. Yeah, there you go. There you go. That's a good angle. That's a great angle. You gotta face the way you wanna look, though, because eventually the camera will correct. Stupid camera. Here we go. Here we go. I have zero interest in the XFL. Zero. Sorry. <laughs> it's never gonna end. Wee 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 wee. Well, it's like this game. The root theme. If you play it, it's wee 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 wee. Chad says we forgot something. That's not good. No, he did. Dude, what in the world? Talk, interact, interact. Here we go. Enjoy your cutscene. Pokemon. It's a nod. It makes it even more heartbreaking and bittersweet that the world is ending in like five yeah, minutes. Yep, yeah, I'm glad dude. you picked up on that because that's the point of this is like they only get to enjoy this reunion dude. for like a very brief time. So you want to know something sad is if you fail part of the mission towards the end. Oh, they look like mother jets a little. That line dialogue, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe for the like, you know, the kids didn't know what was going on at this yeah. point. Just so we make we know. Look at that. Bonds. Like the Nintendo game, we become a couple. I can't say anything more than that. Dude. Please accept this mask. You got the couple's mask. Dude, it looks like, um, Haiku. Haiku? Yeah. Haku? Uh, 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 Naruto? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, dude. Filled with their love. This is my favorite mask ever. All right, Heber. Look at that, we shall greet the morning together. Happy mask! Time okay. to leave. No, you can't play it in here, I think you have to leave outside. So, uh, the alternate version of this. So if you get anywhere towards, like, uh, Sakone's hideout, mm -hmm. and you fail, what will happen is, uh, yeah, she'll wait and he never shows up. You can play it now. Song, normal song of time. She'll wait there, keep waiting for him, and she never, he never shows up. So that's one alternate outcome of that. Another alternate outcome is if you didn't progress far enough, she le you heard the mom's conversation with her? Yeah. She will leave and go to the ranch and wait there. 
And you actually go over there and see, like, their, you know, what goes on with that. Dude. Say no. Why? Huh? I wanted you to say it, right? Chat, well, wait, what are you talking about? They probably want to see the, the moon crash. You can't watch the moon crash because you'll lose the progress. Just save, 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 yeah. save. So they really want you to see this, Huber. So we're gonna do this real quick. The moon crashing? Yes. Okay. We'll do that. Super done. Yeah. Let's do it. So uh Good crunch. Song, of, song of double time. Let's keep spamming it. Okay. It's uh right, right, A A down down. Yeah. do that too so when you get to the last yeah when you get to the last night i'll tell you what to do okay pot crossed buns parappa the rapa dude do you think parappa the rapa will return no blue points parappa the rapa no okay will not happen sorry Kyle. tell me honey crushing dreams thanks uh Glubos. Six months. Six months. Uh, we have enough rupees. We just we need to get the we need to go to uh, the skull ha skull chilla house and get the large root, uh, wallet. He needs to be able to hold five hundred rupees. Yeah. One more after this near there, Huber. Okay. I think Parappa the Rapper will return when Kyle learns the Huber ability of dreams. <laughs> it's a good one. Nice. Uh, chill in front of the... Uh, go up to the clock tower in the front of the door and okay. wait there. Okay. Right here? Uh, go up the ramp. Okay. And then go up the other ramp. And then chill there. Right here? Yeah. When okay. it turns midnight, you can enter. Uh, because you get to see... We're going to show you one other cutscene you can see as well. Cool. For this whole sequence. The chat wanted you to see this too. They want your reactions. Chat demanding the reactions. And then after this, this will be the crunch. Cool. Yeah. The dawn of a new era. React to me, chat. Chat, will you react? Dude, chat. I'm so pumped for Black Widow. Chat, chat, can we get your reactions to Black Widow? React right now, chat. Dude, Black Send Widow. Send me some video links to Black your Widow is going to have a little secret where it, like. A secret? I feel like. I feel like the trailer showed the first, like, 40 minutes of the movie. Oh, and the I rest think. of it is like in so between they, Infinity War and Endgame. You know, like oh, jump, you think you know? there's a jump ahead? Yeah, I think there's some jump. So what in, is it dude. supposed to be set? Is it set? I th we believe it's or what's between. The speculation? the speculation is b between Civil and, and Infinity War. Okay. Speculation. Rampant speculation. speculation. Thank you bandit. Bendito lore. Three months. Thank you. Nothing but speculation. Black Widow movie will be what Red Sparrow should have been. Yeah, it's gonna be I cool. started Red Sparrow and then I remembered hearing such bad things about it on like it was on HBO. Yeah. Now or go whatever. Yeah. And then I stopped and I removed it from my watch it was list because I heard it was just bad. I was like, God. okay, I'm not gonna go through this. I was like, not in the mood for like a really like a not good movie at the moment. I was like, nah, 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 nah. we're not gonna do this. Didn't finish. I have not finished the most recent episode of uh, His Dark Materials. I'm like halfway through Stop. it. How's the buzz? Because I've seen some 
book it seems book really re- cult following right now like the book readers i seeing are really happy with it nice but what beyond that like is it gaining they seem like it's a high budget series is it gaining any traction i have not traction? seen a lot of buzz dude i've not seen a lot it of seems like watchmen just like stole everything and yeah. like it's just yeah. non-existent like bad time no buzz i get what they did it they wanted the best chance of like we need one of these to catch on so people keep subscribing but it's almost like in retrospect, they should have saved his Dark Materials for another time after Watchmen yeah, was over. I agree. Watchmen, dude. Watchmen! Only two more episodes of Watchmen, though. I think the, the biggest concern is can they wrap it all up since it's only one season said, long. Man. Creator's intent! They were like, dude, it's designed for one season. They got it. <sighs> Yeah. You never know, too, with shows nowadays. You never know when a show is j- just going to drop some extended episode. Sorry, the his Dark Materials is BBC. I'm sorry, HBO is paid to license it. You never know when the Watchmen finale is going to be like, oh, it's hour 40 minutes. You're just like, whoa, what? So that's why. Because BBC was like, we don't, what's Watchmen? We don't know. We don't care about Watchmen. Is I really want to Titans? Titans. Explain that. Titans. What's Titans? Titans? Is Watchmen as good as Titans? Titans? Yeah. What the hell's Titans? What's Titans, chat? Teen, Teen Titans. 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 Okay. I don't, I don't okay. have that that service. Yeah, I've not really seen Teen Titans. I want to see it. Don't have the service though. It's nothing personal. I just see, keep hearing Teen Titans brought up a lot, and yeah. I just never touched it. I just I don't have it. There's Tennessee Titans. There's Titan from this, like the there's Titan mythological. E. I thought we were yeah, mythological Titan creature Titan, a yeah. Final Fantasy Titan. Uh, Titans on Netflix. Oh, it is. Yeah, Leftovers is better than Watchmen. Ooh. Whoa, that's bold. Um, How many seasons is Leftovers? Three, dude. Oh my God, Leftovers season three is. I'm really enjoying Watchmen. Now. Wait, did we do a Resident Evil 2 remake stream during Thanksgiving? What? Maybe last year. Was that last year? Uh, thank you for it. I just want to make sure we get take credit for something we actually did. I'm sorry. No, last Thanksgiving was before Resident Evil 2 came out. Oh. Wait, what? When did this happen? You've seen this already. This is back in the very gotta, first three-day yeah, cycle. Yeah. This this part's not new yet. Yeah. yeah. Oh, they probably just watched it. Okay, 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 okay. okay. God. Wait, no, last year. Maybe was Resident Evil 2 regular? Regular? Was it RE3 maybe during uh, Easy Living? Uh, no, was, I don't know. A lot of Resident Evil streams on this channel. Alright. S rank speedrun! Oh, helping you do that, yeah. That was fun. Uh, go up, enter. Go where? Up here. Yeah, you're going up the stairs. There's the DLC stream too, that was fun. Just remember, so don't advance the text here. You've seen all this already. Yeah. I just want to say this, Huber. I will do my best because I know this person right here will be doing the review for it. I kind of want to do, Huber, yeah. my first ever playthrough of RE3 Remake yeah. with you, like me going blind in it. I'm so down, dude. And we do, I won't like, spoil anything. Yeah. The redemption, but like on three remake. Hell yeah! Just be like, oh, Donnie, you think you played so much too? Let's see you do three. <laughs> I'm so down, dude. Bossman can join. Bossman's yeah. got Bossman wouldn't play it though. Bossman just dude, wants Bossman to watch. Bossman loves the Resident Evil streams. Bossman can just be there to we'll heck- get him. Bossman can heckle me. We'll get him. Bossman will be the heckler. Bossman will be in 100. I I can speak for Bossman. By the way, the the hype it up. We shot a new episode of uh, an easy update. I don't, think, I don't know if I'm going to say what it was. I'll say Kyle and I were both on it. Some real good, good moments between Kyle and me. Ian's also there. There's some great moments with Ian as well. But something that, uh, play the Oath to Order. You got to look it up. See, I haven't played it forever. There's some fun stuff there, chat. Not even saying what it is, unless it's been revealed. But if you know what it is, you can say it. But, like, I'm not saying what it is because I'm not spoiling it. But holy crap. Yes. Yes. You will probably want to sit on the RE3 remake playthrough to get revenge. (laughs) 
he doesn't have all of the giants yet, chat, so watch what happens. Yeah, maybe, maybe <laughs> opinion yell on what though, chat? What was the opinion yell? This is freaking me the hell out. Yeah, I know. If he gets the subject of the opinion yell, I'll tell you. Death Stranding. <laughs> we need a Death Stranding opinion yell. Dude, this is Death Stranding. Check this out. Death Stranding right here. People of Earth! Chat, none of you. Give me your energy! Yeah, none of you. Dude! Attack look at this. Titan! Look at this. The hell? That's intense, Huber. God of War. This music is hype. <clears throat> uh oh. He's missing. Hopeless Huber. Don't do anything. Just let the countdown happen. Look up though. Check out. Yeah, just look around, dude. Look at this. Look at this. This is nuts. This is a s spectacle, dude. <laughs> look at this. <laughs> like, the God of War 3 finale that came out like over a decade later is not as mind blowing as this. <laughs> Paul Rugg must have seen this. <laughs> three was Stig. Three was Stig. They wanted to do something, and like the end of three is notoriously, uh, they had to cut some stuff. It has this vibe. Here we go. Pay for this. Terminator shot! Yeah, I, I thought he was like expecting like the face to come off of him. Wow. Wild, dude. That was wild. There you go. That was really cool. It's dark. Oh, let's see my mask you got. <sighs> Pretty. Pretty. 
pretty got good freaking pretty. good lot of mass a lot of today. Them. and you're gonna get a few of them on your way to the final dungeon nice. some of them will be required so yeah. we'll try and fill in the remainder of the mass next time as well as finish the final dungeon we'll try and wrap it up next time um we're, we're so we're gonna before we sign off here before i go and close this out i just want to say next week uh, we'll talk and see if there's another day we can do this on, either maybe Tuesday or potentially Thursday. No, not, sorry, not Thursday, sorry, maybe Tuesday. Um, we could possibly move this to Tuesday. Um, I have something on Wednesday that will not prevent me from being able to be here to do this. Um, I know we got, like, Game Awards stuff, like, going next week, too. So it's, like, it's gonna be kind of busy. So we'll see if the Tuesday maybe works out. So we'll see if maybe we can move this to Tuesday um still do it if not we will be back the week after um and we'll try and wrap it up then at the very least so if we if we have another week next week there's a little bit more time a little bit yeah. more wiggle room where even if we get close to finish we could call it and come back and just do the last bit on the last stream yeah. but our goal is to finish this for the end of the year so we can move on to next game whatever that will be yeah just wanted to say that the next wednesday there will not be one next wednesday but there might be one next week if it happens, it'll probably be next Tuesday. Anything from you, Hooper? That's it. You and uh, stay tuned for the Shenmue 3 schedule. Uh, we're either streaming it this Friday or this Saturday. I'm talking with Brad about it. We're figuring it out. That will be, though, Shenmue 3 Continuation Part 2 this Friday mm -hmm. or Saturday. Check your local listings. That, Hubert, thanks for Prison of Love. It was a masterpiece. <laughs> I really appreciate that. It's been stressing me out like no other. So, seriously, thank you. The plan is uh, every week we're going to do seven more episodes of that seasonal thing. And then uh, back to Huber Syndrome, which will be uh, fun as well. We'll be back to the weekly syndromes. So, thanks so much, chat. Thank you, Damiani. And uh, we will see you tomorrow. Not today. No more streams today. Uh, actually, uh, yeah, I'm going to say that real quick. Yeah. After we sign off here, chat, uh, sorry, after we sign off here, I actually will be doing a, a short, uh, stream after this for a game. Uh, it's not on the schedule. It was supposed to be on the schedule, or maybe it was. I don't know. There will be a stream in just a bit, but I, I need to get food and stuff, so it won't be right away. Probably be in, like, about an hour. I'll be back with a short stream. Um, yeah. Cool. Sorry. But that's it. And uh, hopefully, I, I assume during the holidays, I'll be going back t with uh, Life is Strange Before the Storm. And uh, maybe even Life is Strange 1 as well. So stay tuned for that. And Shenmue 3, of course. Again, Friday or Saturday. So. Thanks, chat. Love y'all.